up with a happy Roblox family. So happy, so, so, so happy. We're mom, dad, Daisy, Molly, and my baby. Kid, baby. <laughs> la, 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 la. Cute little baby. La, 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 la. We're the Star Squad smile. Just chilling on my couch, watching this hilarious video of this um, frog taking a photo of a dog. What? I know, it sounds weird, but it looks hilarious. The dog's making a super funny face. Okay, Molly, whatever you say. Yeah, you just gotta see it to believe it. Hey, um, I wanted to call you because I want to invite you to my sleepover. Not this Saturday, but next Saturday. Holy guacamole! A sleepover? That sounds like so much fun! I go sleepover too. I go, I go, I go. Hold on, my baby sister is kind of being annoying right now. I got annoying. I got cute. I super cute. I cute. Aw, your baby sister is really cute, Molly. I, uh, yeah, but try living with her. Better than having an older brother. He's so annoying. Yeah, well... I would love to come to your sleepover, Brookie, so count me in. Great. Can I count you in to bring some popcorn? Absolutely. I want to go, too. I go, too. Okay, Brookie. Well, uh, I'll see you at school. Okay, bye, Molly. I go your sleepover, please. Uh, no, baby Kira. This is for big kids. But I... I I want to sleep over no fail! I want to sleep over too! Baby Kira, I'm sorry, don't cry. Oh, I feel bad when you cry, even though sometimes you're an annoying little sister. I never like to make you cry. I could cry because I want to have a sleep over like you will not me! <laughs> oh, baby Kira, it's alright. Hey, wait a minute. I have an idea, just stop crying, okay? Okay, I stop crying. What's the idea? Uh, the idea is that you could have your own sleepover with kids your age. Really? I never had a sleepover with Flyzy. Why? I got to do one day. I got to do one day. I got to do Baby Kira, use real words. I know you talk baby talk when you get really excited. I ain't dying because I have a sleepover. What I got to do first? Okay, first we got to just sit here and chill out. That's not what you do, I know it. Come on, let have a sleepover, please, please, please. Okay, okay, baby Kira. Well, the first thing you have to consider is what you want to have as snacks. And since the sleepover is, well, tonight. We you having it tonight? Well, yeah, we can't have it next weekend. That's when my sleepover is. Okay, so in the refrigerator, let's see what we have for snacks. We have pizza. Everyone loves pizza. I have pizza, too. We have Reese Cups. Ooh, I eat that now. You have to save it for the sleepover. We have soda, some Hershey bars, some milk. Um, We also have ice cream, waffles for breakfast in the morning. You're all set in the food department. You're just going to want to get some popcorn. But I'll pick that up for you since you're too little to go shop at the grocery store. You're the best sister. Aww. Thank you. You're welcome, baby Kira. Now, the second thing you need to do is make sure your room is not a total disaster. <laughs> Because if it is, no one will have room to put their sleeping bags. Come on, baby Kara, get in the elevator. What are you waiting for? All right, so let's go into um, baby Kara's room. Whoops, this is mom and dad's room. Wrong room. Here's baby Kara's room. Um, And it looks like our room is really clean. She has lots of room for sleeping bags and tents and stuff to have the best sleepover ever. Baby Kara? Baby Kira, did you get stuck in the elevator again? Okay, no, she didn't. What are you doing? I don't no way to go up there, because if it's a mess, I don't want to clean it. What? You were going to let me clean your dirty room? Uh-huh, yep, I do it. Oh, little sisters are so annoying. If you agree with me, slam the like button. All right, 
so those two things are handled. So you only have one thing left to do. What if I do it? I do it for best sleepover. When you go to preschool today, invite all the people you want to come to your sleepover. Really? That's it? Yep. And then when you get home, all your friends will show up and you'll have your first sleepover ever. That's that easy. I do it. I go preschool right now by all my friends. Okay, well, you can't walk the... You can't walk there alone, baby Kira! Oh my gosh. You don't even know not to look... To, to not go out in front of cars. You have to look both ways. Wait, I'm done looking both ways. Okay, come on. I'll walk you there. Good morning, Miss Maggot. Good morning, baby Kira. Nice to have you here at preschool today. Thank you. I gotta go see my friends. Well, I hate to tell you, but most of your friends are out sick today. It seems that the flu bug is going around and everyone's throwing up. Ew, of course. That's kind of sad, though, because I could have a, a, a party. I almost said birthday. Ah, but it's not a birthday party. It's sleepover. Whoa, is this your first sleepover? Yeah, it's my first one. Well, we do have two students here today. Oh, are they my friends? Well, they're new students, so I don't think they are, but I bet they'd love to go to a sleepover. Okay, I'll see if they want to, because it's tonight, and everyone else not feeling good. Okay, well, come on, let's play. <laughs> You've probably met adorable little Annabelle, but we call her Greenie for short, since she has such beautiful green eyes. Hi, Annabelle. I've been mean, Greenie. Uh, I'm Baby Kira, and I don't think we've ever met before. Hi, I'm Annabelle, but you can call me Greenie. Red light. <laughs> she loves red light, green light. <laughs> That's another reason why we call her Greenie. Where's the other student? Oh, oh, bye. She looks a little, well, evil. Oh, that's um actually a boy. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I thought maybe you were a girl. No, oh, I'm not a girl. I'm a boy. Oh, well, okay. What's your name? His name is Chucky. Oh, okay. I just wondering, do you want to come to my sleepover? Uh, yeah, come to your sleepover. <laughs> Chucky, remember what we talked about? Your crazy laughing makes the other students a little nervous. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Look, that's so creepy, but you can still come to my sleepover. It starts it um, right after preschool. Okay, everybody, let's have playtime. Mmm, this popcorn I made is delicious. Baby Kira and all of her best friends are going to love it. Mm. delicious. Oh, Baby Kira must be home. I tell him right now. Ah, you scared me. I didn't know you were here that quick. I thought maybe you were at the front door, not standing right behind me. I thought he didn't mean to scare you. I invited two friends, um, but they're new friends. You invited two new friends? Well, why don't you invite your best friends? Do I have the stomach bug and I'm throwing up? Ew, so glad you didn't catch that. Me too. Why well, be my new friends? Their names are um, Annabelle, but everyone calls her Greeny. Greeny? Why? Yes, he. And also Chucky. You invited a boy to your sleepover? Yeah, he's new. Okay, fine. I'll come meet them. Where are they? I feel bad. Well, they can come inside. Tell your friends they can come in. <sighs> this is going to be a long night with a kid's um, babysickly, like a kid's babysitting session because that's what I'm going to have to do. <gasps> oh, oh. These these are the kids you invited? Yeah, what's wrong with that? I take up the dice. Oh, that's the doll from the squid. What are you talking about? Never even heard of that. And that, and that, that's, that's Chucky! I know with Chucky. He told me his name was Chucky. Yeah, I know, but I mean it's Chucky like as in Chucky Chucky! The doll who comes to life. Why you say that so many times? They're not that, they're people. Okay, um, maybe they just look like those characters and they're not really that. <laughs> Wait, anybody like some popcorn and to watch a movie? 
I like popcorn. I want some. <laughs> Bad guy. Green guy. Ah! Okay. Uh, maybe Kira, have fun in your sleepover. Mom, leave what you think. I need your help. No, I'm just going to eat popcorn over here. And hide inside the washing machine where I feel safe and no one will find me. Let's watch a movie. Hey, Queenie, where are you? Oh, good. They're watching a movie. Finally, I'm safe. Red light. Green light. Ah! Look at look at her eyes. They, 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 they look like, like lasers. Red light. Green light. Oh, my God. That was scary. You have to get out of my house. Get out. Why? Why? Why are you being mean to my friends? Her, her eyes, they turn into lasers. She's not normal. My, you food. I'm pretty sure Big Food is in the power of having a sleepover. Okay, everybody, movie's over. Time for bed. That is short sleepover. Well, that's how it goes. <laughs> They're done before you know it. Everybody upstairs into bed. Oh, my gosh. I just want them all going to sleep and for this terrible, terrible sleepover to be over. <sighs> I should have given her more instruction about who to invite. Okay, kids, everybody spread out your sleeping bags, and I don't want to hear a peep from any of you. Uh, all of you must go to sleep. Chucky, you can sleep over here on the floor. Okay, I brought a sleeping bag. <laughs> Stop laughing, it's creepy. Good night, everybody! Baby Kira, I hope you survive the night. Oh my gosh. <sighs> so creepy. I'm glad I'm going to be in my own room. Too bad my door doesn't have a lock. <laughs> what was that? What was that? Ah, it's Chucky! I knew you were evil! Of course I am. <laughs> now come here. Ah! Ah! Oh my gosh! Where am I gonna go? I'm gonna jump over the balcony. Yep, sounds like a good idea. Ah! Where can I go to hide? Where can I go to hide? Red light. Ah! It's, it's, it's a squid doll! Green light. Okay, as long as I'm only moving when, when she's saying red light or green light, I'll be fine. Red light. Ah! Why are you saying that? Ah! She said red light. She said red light. <laughs> Why did I say baby could have a sleepover? Why did I say baby Kira could have one? <laughs> Red light, green light. I can't believe that Mrs. Harris gave me so much homework. My goodness, I've been doing this homework for two hours. I need to take a break and play a game. Ooh, I like this flying game. This looks cool. Daisy, Kakashoba boy, Daisy. Oh, hi, baby Cuba. What are you doing? Ah, 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 ah. Scary, scary. Kakashoba boy, scary. What's scary, baby Cuba? I don't know what you're even talking about right now. Oh, you're talking about my Charlie doll? turns its head because it has batteries in it. You want me to take the batteries out? Oh, Snooky Gumby! It's Snooky Gumby! It's Gumby! It's Gumby! It's just a toy. It's just a doll, baby kill Everything is fine, see? It's very friendly, doll. Uh-uh. Uh-uh, it's Gumby! It's Gumby! I'm going to my room. Okay, baby Kira, good night. Make sure you brush your teeth before you go to bed. Huh. I'm getting kind of tired too. I guess I'll go to sleep myself. <sighs> Turn off the light. And night night. <laughs> They're all asleep. <laughs> 
Boing, 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 boing. Ah! What's that? What's that? What was that? Hey, wait a minute. Why is my Charlie doll standing up to bed? I didn't leave that there. Must be baby Q was playing a trick on me. Okay, I'll just go back to sleep. Oh, very funny, baby Q. Very funny. <laughs> <laughs> what was that sound? I thought I heard something. Oh, it's probably nothing. Why is the TV running? I hear something so weird. What's going on? Whoa! Why is the TV on? No, it <gasps> the Charlie doll is out here. Creepy. Okay, Charlie doll, are you alive? Charlie doll? Okay, if you're being a naughty doll and coming to life, then I don't know, I'm gonna have to take you to the Salvation Army and donate you. Cause that's just creepy. I, it's probably just me having a bad dream and baby kills playing tricks on me because seriously, um, dolls don't move. <laughs> Whoa, why does it sound like someone's banging on the piano right now? Oh my gosh, what does it sound? I'm kind of creeped out, I'm not... <gasps> it's the Charlie doll! Why is it Charlie doll standing near the piano? That's it, I'm gonna go see Baby Kira and ask her why this is happening. <laughs> Baby Kira, wake up! Wake up! Something really creepy is happening right now! Baby Kira, wake up! Look, I can't jump up by! You got rainbows and unicorns! Oh, that's nice that you were dreaming about rainbows and unicorns, but I don't believe you because you kept moving my Charlie doll! Uh-uh, not me, not me! Yes, you! I was so afraid I thought my Charlie doll came to life! Ooh! Da creepy, da creepy. Da Charlie's not creepy. You just keep moving it. No, 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 no. I heal, I heal. You're saying that you stayed in your room this entire time? Okay, baby killer, if you say so. But I better keep an eye on Charlie. He's just getting too creepy. Ah, <sighs> Okay, baby Kira, night night. Watch out for Charlie. I gotta go back to bed myself. <laughs> Somebody laughs really creepy. Must be baby Kira in her dreams. Oh, how do I get out of here? Don't worry, I 
can't help you! Just run after me! Hey, by the way, nice unicorn tail. Where'd everybody go? I just wanted to play! Oh, well, guess I'm gonna have to play with this unicorn all by myself! Ooh, I'm kind of hungry. Hmm, what's there to eat in here? No, I don't want to wash my hands! I want to eat a snack. <laughs> Ooh, a gelatin cake. That sounds delicious. What are you doing in my kitchen? You creepy dog, you! <laughs> Seriously, you're making a cake? But I thought you were kind of mean and creepy and stuff. Oh no, I just kind of misunderstood. I really just want someone that will be in my family. And I make a really awesome gelatin cake. But you look like Chucky and Chuppy. Chucky is so creepy. Oh, that's my cousin. Yeah, he is kind of creepy, but I'm Charlie. And Charlie's super nice. You look kind of creepy. I can't help it. I was born this way. This is your papa. Creepy, creepy. Chucky, Chucky, creepy. No, really, I'm not creepy. Here, you can have some of this cake if you want. Oh, it's Chucky! It's Chucky! I'm not Chucky! I'm Charlie. Sheesh. Nobody wants a Charlie doll. Everybody always just wants a Chucky, and I don't even know why, because Chuckies are just mean. Here you go, I made you this cake. <laughs> you are a super creepy laugh! Oh, sorry. <laughs> I don't really mean to sound creepy. I really don't. Ooh, did you want to buy a cupcake? How do we know that this cake isn't gross? Hmm. Suit yourself, but I think it's delicious. Okay, Charlie, I guess you're not so bad. I was going to donate you to the Salvation Army because you were really creeping me out. Oh, it's Chucky! It's Chucky! Um, yeah, we're kind of over the fact that it's, um, not Chucky. Yeah, I'm not Chucky. Well, I guess you could stay, but no more jumping on my bed. Oh, that part's fun! Yeah, but my sister does that too much already. You have another sister? Yeah, maybe we could play a little prank on her. She doesn't know that you're Charlie. Maybe she thinks you're Chucky. Do you want to help us out, Charlie? Sure, I'll help you. Okay, just go wait for her in her room in there. Okay, sounds good. I can't wait to see when Molly gets home and thinks that Chucky doll is in her bed. <laughs> this is going to be the best one ever. <laughs>
Oh uh, yeah, Molly, I'm gonna make a pass on that um, sleepover then. What, no, Brookie, we get DoorDash. All right, now you're speaking my language. Uh, what time do you want me to come over? Like, um, now? Buddy, she still has to pack her suitcase and stuff. Yeah, Molly, I totally have to pack my suitcase, but then I'll come over. Uh, what should we door dash? I don't know, Chinese, pizza, um, what are, what are you feeling? Do you, do you want some tacos? Ooh, tacos, that sounds delicious, except for when Molly eats bean burritos, it's a bad sleepover for, for everybody. <coughs> well, I don't know what you're talking about. You know exactly what I'm talking about, Molly. Okay, Molly, well, I'll see you soon, okay? Okay, bye, Brookie. Sleepover. So excited. Yeah, this is gonna be a really good time. Wait a minute. Who said you were invited to sleepover? <gasps> Wait, what? I, I live here. Of course I'm invited. You said that you didn't want tacos. And I love tacos. Uh, Molly, Brookie's not gonna stay for very long if you're farting at the sleepover. <laughs> okay, maybe we should order a pizza then. Whoa, creepy. The Roomba just went off all by itself, and I didn't even tell it to. I swear, our Roomba is totally possessed. Okay, I just got to pack my hair dryer, my hairspray. Um, I should probably make a list. I'm gonna need tons of stuff. I wonder if Molly also wants me to like bring some popcorn, because she said she didn't have any at her house, and I really wanna eat popcorn if we're gonna watch a movie. I'm gonna text her right now and see if she wants me to bring it. I'm all set to go. I'm so excited for this sleepover. It's going to be so much fun. Molly, Blookie's here. I just got the notification from the ring camera. Come on in, Blookie. The door's open. Hey, guys. I'm really excited to see you. Wait, where's Molly? She's still here, right? Oh, yeah. She's just getting in her pajamas for this party. She said she wanted to get comfy cozy. The queen of the sleepover has arrived. Um, hey, Molly. Uh, are you wearing pajama bottoms with potatoes on them? <laughs> They're happy potatoes because they didn't turn into french fries. Get it? <laughs> Molly, you're so funny. Um, yeah, that joke was kind of crazy. Uh, yeah, it was hilarious, though. You just don't have a sense of humor. So, Brookie, what do you want to do first? Yeah, but I don't have a sense of humor. I'm hilarious, Molly. Um, well, first I think you two sisters should stop fighting. This, that's not a very fun sleepover. Okay, sorry, Brookie, don't go home. We're really bored and we don't want you to leave. Yeah, Brookie, we've been really excited that you're coming over. I really love your potato pajamas. They're adorable, Molly. Thanks, Rookie. So what game should we play first? Or should we door dash or something? Uh, yeah. Let's play a game and then door dash. All right, Rookie. Uh, you can just take your suitcase and put it in the laundry room. That way you don't have to, like, carry it all the way up the stairs right now. You can just stick it in there. Oh, oh, sorry, Molly. You didn't mean to run into you. Ow! You wheeled over my foot with your suitcase! Ah! Call the paramedics! Wee! 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 Oh, my God. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm just fine. I'm being ridiculous right now, but I'm just trying to be funny. Oh, first you were laughing about the pajamas and making a joke about french fries and stuff, and now you're just pranking me. Ah, oh, Molly, you're just, well, Molly. Yeah, I couldn't be anybody else, even if I tried. I wish you would sometimes, Molly, be just a little less, well, Molly. Not a chance! I am me, and I am awesome! All right, I have a perfect game. Everybody come in and sit down. So Molly, what game are we gonna play? Truth or dare? <laughs> oh no, this never ends well. Okay, um, I'm gonna go first since I thought of it. Brookie, truth or dare? Um, um, I'm so nervous, I don't know what to pick. Okay, truth. Okay, all right, here we go. This question has been in my mind for like two weeks now. Do you remember when there was somebody who farted in gym class? Uh-oh. Uh, yeah. And everyone just blamed it on the sewer from the toilet. But I'm pretty sure it was you, Brookie. So my question is, did you fart in gym class? Um, uh, uh. Don't look at your phone like you're trying to avoid it. Answer the question. 
I, um, uh, well, you have to answer when you're playing Truth or Dare. Maybe I should just go home. <laughs> you, you can't just, like, get out of Truth or Dare by doing going home. You, you have to just, like, you have to answer. Okay, yes! I murdered in gym right in front of the boy I had a crush on, and it was so embarrassing. There, are you happy with the truth? Very happy. <laughs> I knew it. Okay, now I get to ask somebody. Um, Daisy, truth or dare? I don't like this game. Daisy! Okay, I pick, um, dare. Alright, I dare you to look super ugly on Snapchat. <gasps> what? That's the worst deal ever for fashion you to like me. Um, Daisy, you have to do it. You picked dare. Fine. <laughs> Good one, Brookie. Can't wait to see this Snapchat come in. I can't believe I'm about to send this Snapchat. This is so embarrassing. <laughs> I can't wait to see this. It's gonna be funny. Yeah, totally. Truth or Dare is one of my favorite games ever. Here it is! Daisy! <laughs> <laughs> What's going on with your hair? Well, I teased it up a little bit. What are you wearing? Something from your closet. <laughs> no, you're not! <laughs> I am, Molly. You wear all sorts of ugly stuff. Ooh. Um... No, look at my adorable unicorn sweatshirt. Are you guys gonna fight this entire sleepover? Uh, no, I don't think so. Uh, who's hungry? Cause I am, I'm so hungry. I'm gonna door dash right now. I've never seen anybody so excited about door dash than you, Molly. I know, I love door dash. It makes me wanna jump in the air. So Molly, what did you order? Um, I was super hungry and you should never order door dash when you're starving. Uh, so I ordered, like, one of everything. One of everything? One of everything what? Tacos, Chinese food, pizza, you name it. Pretty much all of it's gonna be delivered. OMG, Molly! Well, I guess we're gonna have full tummies when we finish out our sleepover. Finish our sleepover? Oh, no. We're getting to the best part. After we eat our food, it's time for creepy stories. Oh, uh, Molly, I'm not so sure about that. Yes. Creepy stories! We're doing it! Uh, is this the house? Uh, no, I don't think that's it. Wait, wait. Why doesn't anybody put their addresses on their mailbox? Ugh! I can never find out what address I'm actually going to. Okay, yeah, I, okay, I think this is actually the driveway. Alright. Molly, are you just gonna sit there or are you gonna come back for truth or dare? Um, I door dash, so I'm waiting for my door dash. Um, Molly, you can sit in here. Yeah. Oh, wait! No, the ring camera just ran off! Okay, they're here with our food! Hi, DoorDash delivering, like, all the food in the entire Roblox game. Like, jeepers, we have, like, a huge party. Uh, no. Me, my sister, and my friend, but, um, we're really hungry. Yeah, that's it. Okay, well, thanks for the food. Uh, are you gonna give me a tip? Um, um, sorry, I don't really have money for a tip right now. I have, like, a quarter. Oh, I hate this dog! Sorry! Food's here! Food's here! Ooh, that looks delicious. You got so much food for us. Yeah, well, I just wanted you to have the best time at this sleepover ever. Alright, guys, let's go eat. This sweet and sour chicken is delicious. Mmm, so good. I like the pizza, Molly. Mmm, this is delicious. You want to try a bite? Um, yeah, but... Do I have to share my sweet and sour chicken with you? Uh, I guess not, Molly. Okay, you can have a little bit. <laughs> Since you are my best friend. Uh, gee, thanks, Molly. Ugh, I'm so full. I've got to go put my fat pants on. <laughs> Your fat pants? Yeah, basically they're the pants that have an elastic waistband. So basically my stomach can, can continue to grow as my food gets farther and farther into my tummy. I call them my fat pants. <laughs> I need a pair of fat pants. Wow, Brookie, you look super cozy. I am, Molly. I told you, these are my coziest pants ever. Oh, I'm so full from all of that sweet and sour chicken. So worth it, though. So worth it. Come on, Daisy. Hurry up with putting your pajamas on. I have an extremely creepy story to tell you guys. And I think it might even be true. Are you ready for this creepy story? 
I'm not sure, Molly. It's almost time to go to sleep, and I might have nightmares. Yeah, Molly, are you sure? Yeah. Don't you want to hear my creepy story? I am pretty curious, but don't make it lame. Yeah, Molly. If you're going to make it a scary story, make it really scary. The scariest part about this is it could be true. What? No, Molly, you're just pranking us. No, seriously. I was on TikTok the other day, and I saw this, and it was crazy. Really? What was it, Molly? So, apparently, if you go in the bathroom at night, and you get on Snapchat, and you look in the mirror and say Bloody Mary three times, she will appear in your Snapchat. Wait, what? I've heard the story of Bloody Mary before, but I've never heard that she'd appear on your Snapchat. Me either, Molly. I don't think that's true. Well, we could test it. <gasps> um, no, I don't think so. <laughs> I'm good with not knowing if that's really true or not. Yeah, Molly, that seems kind of creepy. You really would test it? I think so. When she appears on your Snapchat, you have exactly three days until she comes for you. Wait, what? Yeah, Molly, don't try that. Well, <laughs> that was the creepiest story ever. I'm probably never going to sleep now. You'll be fine, Brookie, because you're not going to actually say Bloody Mary three times. But I think I am. Why, Molly? Because someone said it's true, and I want to know. I mean, what could she possibly do? Someone on Snapchat can't really hurt you. Um, Molly, I'd be careful. Bloody Mary is not someone to mess with. Yeah. I like you too, Luke. Um, I think Brookie is having a dream about Luke. Wait, does she have a crush on him? <laughs> well, I'm not sleeping at all, because it's almost 12.30 at night, and I really want to see if I go in the bathroom and say Bloody Mary into the mirror while making a Snapchat. She really does appear. I mean, what's the worst thing that could happen? Sure, I'll go to the dance with you, Luke. You're so cute. Ugh, I can't believe she has a crush on Luke. Ew. Yeah. Really could happen. It's just a myth, like, right? I mean, I don't know. I, I think it's just a fib. It's just a myth, a prank. It can't really happen. Um, but I am gonna try it because she can't hurt us. Even if if Bloody Mary does appear, it's like, so what? I mean, she's just gonna be on my Snapchat. And I'd probably be pretty popular in school, too. All right. Well, here, here goes nothing. B -b 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 Come on! Be brave, Molly! B -b 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 I can't make myself say it! Bloody Mary! <sighs> I'm kind of scared. B -b -b Bloody Mary! B -b Bloody Mary! <sighs> I knew it. It's a myth. Why is my phone going off at like one o'clock in the morning? Who could that possibly be? Ah! Oh, what is that? Is that Bloody Mary? Oh my god, I actually said her name! She's behind Molly and in and in and in and in! Oh my god! This is so bad! I I oh my god, I gotta wake up Daisy! Daisy was not gonna believe this! I believe it because I see it too! Bloody Mary is standing behind Molly in her Snapchat! Oh my god, this is crazy! Huh? What, what are you guys yelling about? Molly, did you... Did you say you know what into the mirror when you were Snapchatting? <laughs> yeah, nothing even happened. Really? Well, look at this. Molly, this means it's only a matter of time for, before she comes back for you. Wait, what? Let me see that. Ah! Why is she standing behind me? I saw that snap, and, and there was nobody there. Molly, she she was behind you the whole time. Um, uh, time to move to Brookhaven. Or Bloxburg. Or, um, I don't know, throw away Roblox completely. Uh, what? No, Molly. Bloody Mary can find you anywhere. That's how this goes. How do you know? Just Googled it. Well, Google knows everything. Oh, God, we're in so much trouble. Correction, Molly, you're in so much trouble. We didn't say Bloody Mary. Uh, yes, you did. Ah! Oh, my God, I've said it twice. Don't say it again or she's going to be after you. 
Well, you didn't see it while you were looking in a mirror, so you should be okay. Um, can you see re your reflection in your phone? <laughs> yeah. Well, that's mirror enough. <laughs> Don't say her name even one more time. Oh my god! Molly! I mean, you're an annoying sister at all, but I never wanted Bloody Mary to come get you! Well, I don't know what to say, guys, but this is probably gonna be my last ever. <laughs> this pizza is so delicious. Mm, so good. I think I'm gonna have this, and then I'm gonna have the leftover Chinese food, and... Buddy, what are you doing? You're eating, like, so much food right now. Well, I figured this is my last day alive. I should make it worth it by eating everything I love. Ugh. But I should borrow Brookie's fat pants, because my pants are getting a little tight. Buddy, take this seriously, please! Call the police! Daisy, I can't call the police on Bloody Mary. She's not even really alive. She's just, like, an evil spirit or something. Police aren't gonna be able to do anything. Oh my god, Molly, this is terrible. Mm, those are pizza. Oh, it's Bloody Mary! Oh no, it's just Brookie. Hey, Brookie, wh why are you crying? Because, Molly, today's the last day I'm ever gonna see my best friend. Is that pepperoni on that pizza? Yeah, you want some? Sure. <laughs> Guys, I still think that this might be just a fluke or something. No, Molly, I think that it's really probably, well... The end of you! Yeah, Molly. We're gonna miss you. Okay, everybody stop being so crazy crazy right now. <laughs> um, I'm gonna be fine. Okay, if you say so. I'm gonna go outside and get some fresh air. It's getting a little crazy in here right now. I just, I need to, I need to get out of here. Wow, my sister and my best friend are really taking this seriously. I mean, I, I don't think that Bloody Mary is really real. <sighs> I'm gonna do a snap. Just cause, I don't know, uh, it makes me feel better if I can just like do a silly snap and like look at this one. <laughs> That's so adorable. La 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 la. Everyone thinks this is the last day of my life. But the day's almost over and I don't see Bloody Mary anywhere. So I'm thinking I'm probably just fine. What's wrong with this phone? My battery life isn't low. Ugh, my snaps aren't working. Ugh, I need a new iPhone, like seriously. There we go. It's working again. Ah! This is, this is, this is, this is Bloody Mary on my Snapchat! Ah! Okay, it's just on Snapchat. It's not real. It's not real! person like someone's chasing her what is she doing ah bloody mary please D don't kill me please oh my god she's chasing me oh um, molly are you okay what can't you see bloody mary she's chasing me Blah! um no molly we don't see anything ah, ah! wait a minute i think she's gone i i ah, no she's back ah, oh my god she just kissed me in her head. answering her phone she always answers when i call it's so weird all right i'm gonna try calling her one more time come on brookie pick up pick up pick up buddy who are you calling i'm calling brookie because i don't really understand that math homework and i figured maybe she would maybe she'd come over and help me i'll help you molly hello no daisy i don't want you to help me why because you think i'm so smart wait a minute did you guys just call me to argue over the phone and have me listen to it Probably that's the way Molly is. No, no, it's not. How rude. Sorry, Brookie. My sister's just being really annoying right now. Don't listen to her. Guys, stop arguing when I'm on the phone. I'm going to hang up. I tried calling you like a bunch of times, Brookie, but you didn't answer. Oh, yeah, sorry. I was trying to figure out this math homework. 
Jiminy Cricket, so wasn't I. It was really difficult. Yeah, mm, I just can't figure out number five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, or 15. <laughs> That's pretty much all of it, Brookie. I know. Hey, do you want to come over for a sleepover? Maybe we can figure it out together. I could door dash a pizza. Sounds amazing. I'll be there soon. Okay, bye. I'm going to go take a shower before Brookie gets here. Okay, fine, whatever. Do I look like I really cared what you were doing? Buddy, woo! Ugh, sisters. Rookie, what, what is it? Do you need to know what pajamas to pack or something? I like the ones with strawberries on them. They're adorable! <laughs> I see you. Uh, Brookie? That's not very funny. Stop pranking me now. Do you like scary movies? Uh, not really. Who is this? <laughs> huh, creepy prank caller. Goodbye. <phone rings> Buddy, I can't believe you pranked me like that. Wait, what? What are you talking about? I just got a prank call. What? No, it said you called me. Well, it said Brookie called me. Well, somebody definitely was Wobo calling us then because it was creepy. Yeah, tell me about it. The person who called me said, I see you, and do you like scary movies? Uh, yeah, that's exactly what they said to me. Uh, that kind of creeps me out. Nah, it was probably just Sarah the bully or something being totally mean to us. Don't worry about a thing. Now, go take your shower before Brookie gets here. You don't want to be smelly, do you? Yeah. I'm never smelly. You're the one that doesn't ever take a shower, Molly. I take a shower, like once a week, if I really need it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited to see my best friend. Hey, Molly, are you ready for the sleepover? Sure am. Huh. It was a little bit crazy, though, before you got here. What were you talking about? Well, somebody, like, used your number to call me and prank me. Wait, what? Are you serious? Yeah, and they have a really creepy voice and stuff, but I'm just sure it's, like, Sarah the Bully from school or something. Oh, that is creepy. Well, come on, let's go work on that math homework. Yeah, and then I have a new scary movie I want to watch. How about you? I don't know, a scary movie? Especially after a creepy call? It's going to be fine, Brookie. I'm sure it was just somebody from school pranking us. Now, come on, let's go work on that math homework so we can get it over with. Homework is not my favorite thing. Me either, Molly. So, I think for number five, the answer should be 236. What do you think, Brookie? Well, uh, that's what I got too, so I'm thinking that must be the right answer. Okay, cool. Uh, so we just have like two more problems to go. Should I make some popcorn? I'm starting to get really hungry. Hey guys, um, are you guys ready to um, watch a movie or something? Well, we do still have two more problems of our homework to go, but I suppose we could do it in study hall tomorrow before class. I really wanna watch this scary movie. Me too. Really? You really do? Yeah, you convinced me, Molly. I'm sure that was just a prank call. Nothing creepy or anything like that. It did sound creepy. Wait, you got the prank call too? Yeah, I got it. Was it from my number? No, it was from Molly's number. Are you sure Molly wasn't pranking us the whole time? She could be. You just never know with Molly sometimes. I need the popcorn, guys. It looks super delicious. Oh, man, you made it extra buttery, my favorite. I'm just going to sit over here and uh, eat the whole thing. Molly, give us some. <laughs> All right, I'll get you guys a bowl so you can have some too. Whoa, Molly, don't enter the house at midnight. This new movie looks so scary. Yeah, it totally does. I'm going to take a Snapchat of us um, watching this scary movie. Okay, everybody get behind Brookie so we can do a Snapchat. Uh, Daisy, are you coming? Yeah, I was just still eating some of my popcorn and I didn't want popcorn corners in my teeth. <laughs> All right, everybody, um, tell us, tell everybody what you're doing. I'm eating delicious buttery popcorn with my best friend and my annoying sister and we're about to watch a new movie. Molly, it's a scary movie and um, we're pretty excited about it, especially since we got a prank call tonight. Yeah, you guys, that was so crazy and creepy. All right, well, that's the end of our snap. Okay, let's watch the movie. Actually, first I'm going to go upstairs and go to the bathroom, okay? 
Um, because I drank way too much soda. Oh, I got our snack. Oh, look at us. We look adorable. I love it. Oh my gosh, my phone is buzzing. Well, maybe Pookie's out of toilet paper or something. You don't ever change a toilet paper roll, Molly. <laughs> yeah, that's probably what it is. What? It's a Snapchat from outside our house. It just says, he, 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 he. Like, it's in the backyard. What? That's creepy, Molly. Our backyard is completely fenced with like an eight foot tall fence. Who could that be? Um, I don't know. Stay away from the windows, Molly. I don't want you to see something creepy. Well, I don't know if I should call 911 or what. What? What's going on, guys? I just got a snap just sent specifically to me. And it said, like, ha, ha, ha. And it was from our backyard. And it was a picture of, like, a snap of, like, me and Daisy from outside. What? That's so creepy. Do you think this has anything to do with it? With the phone call you got earlier? Um, I, I don't know. I, I don't think so. How'd they get in our backyard? It's totally creepy. Well, I mean, if you called the police, you couldn't really say anything because I don't see anyone in your backyard. Let's just ignore it happened and watch the movie. What? Whoa. I just got another stamp, Molly, and you're not gonna like it. What? Why? What is it? Do you <laughs> like scary movies? Ha! Ah, that's exactly what the person on the phone said. And it looks like they took a picture of us from the front of the house. Oh, M, G. Oh my gosh, my phone is ringing. Should I answer it? Um, maybe it's your mom. That would be a good thing if it was your mom. Yeah, answer it, Pookie. You definitely should. Okay. Um, hello? Do you like scary movies? Oh my god, guys. It's him. Um, who are you and why are you pranking us? Yeah, good question, Bricky. Good question. <laughs> I see you. Ah, uh, I. Uh, uh, where do you see us? Ask him that. Where do you see us? I'm right outside your house. <laughs> now tell me, what's your favorite scary movie? I don't like scary movies. I changed my mind. Tell him we only like to watch Coco Ballet or Blippi or, um, you know, something like that. Something really fun. No scary movies here. Nope, nope, nope. We don't like scary movies. You don't? <laughs> I think you're watching one right now. Um, well, then you're not looking good because we turned the TV off like five minutes ago there, genius. Who's that? Put her on the phone. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> You got nowhere to go. I'm outside your house. Rookie, hang up the phone. Hang it up. Um, goodbye. You're being really rude. What are we gonna do? Um, we're gonna go upstairs and lock the door. Come on! Alright, guys, which room would be the safest? Probably the one with the least amount of windows. This one seems the safest. Okay, okay, okay. Molly, don't lock me out. What are you doing? Sorry about that. Okay. Um, see if we can see him down below. I, I don't see him anywhere. <laughs> Daisy, quit closing the curtains. I can't see anything. I don't want him to see us either, Molly. Okay, well, so far I don't see him anywhere. So I think that's probably a good thing. Huh. <sighs> are we safe? I don't know who that guy is, but... Maybe we should call 911. Good idea. I'm calling the police. Are they answering, Molly? It's still ringing. 911? What's your emergency? There's this creepy guy. He's outside our windows. Or outside our house, I mean. And and he pranked called us and then he was taking pictures on Snapchat outside our house. And 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 I, I I'm just freaking out because I think he might be a crazy psycho. And can you send a police officer over like right away? It's me, my sister, and my friend that are here. So you need a police officer? Uh, yeah. Right away. I have a question for you before I send a police officer up. Okay. W -w 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 what is it? Do you like scary movies? Ah! Oh my god! How did you get- How did you get on this phone line? <laughs> I hacked it. I know what room you're in. <laughs> oh, you're all in trouble now. Okay, I have a plan. 
My mom has an iPad in the other room. I bet he doesn't have any hacked access to that. Yeah, Molly, it is a super old iPad. He wouldn't even know about it. Well, one of us needs to be brave enough to go in there. Uh, huh. I'll do it, guys. Uh, it's the least I can do. I mean, because you guys are my best friends. Brookie, no! I have to, guys. It's, it's for the good of us all. Okay, Brookie, we'll just get the iPad and run right back here, okay? Good luck, Brookie. Stay safe. What? I got another Snapchat? Oh no. This can't be good. Wait. What is that? It's a, it's a picture of us from the, 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 the room that we're in. What? Where's that iPad? I need to find it really fast and then go back and be with Molly and Daisy. I'm afraid to be in here by myself. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Okay, think. Where would I put an old iPad and a charger for it too? Maybe it's in the nightstand. I don't know. I mean... <laughs> what? Who, who, who are you? Ah! Ha! Oh my god. I tried to hide in the crib, but he still sees me. <laughs> Why does Laura have a baseball bat next to her bed? Oh well. I don't care. It's time to... Well, meet your doom, you evil thing. Whatever. Who, what are you? A monster? Like a demon? <laughs> you can't take me down. I can't be killed. Well, I wasn't planning on that, but I'm pretty sure this baseball bat upside your kneecap is going to feel pretty good. You can't take me. Oh, that hurt. Yeah, right. I can't take you down. Try messing with Brookie Cookie ever again. <laughs> Daisy, what was that sound? I don't know. It sounded like a fight in the other room. Do you think that that guy got in and... And, and got Brookie, our best friend? What would we do if something ever happened to her? I don't know, Molly, but we have to go try to rescue her. Okay, we have to be brave. What? There's the killer. Brookie, what are you doing? Well, I totally hit him with a baseball bat. <laughs> he didn't like that very much. And now I'm taking a Snapchat to show everybody this creepy guy who is obviously going to prison now. I just wanted to... I, I... I wanted to know if you like scary movies. Um, well, um... <laughs> Brookie! That snap is awesome! Okay, let's read some text. Some, I'm gonna text it on it. Wait, I wanna take a Snapchat and send it. <laughs> Look at this, guys. We captured this guy. And we're gonna call the police. Oh, let's... Like, let's give him a funny face. <laughs> Guys, well, that's too funny. Let's give him a rainbow face. La 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 la. <laughs> Ghost face, what do you think of that, huh? Oh, yeah, look at that, guys. Let's send this to everybody. <laughs> I can't believe you can't do such brats. Do, 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 do. So, Ghost face, this is the end of you. Here's some daisies for you. I wonder if this ever happens to Jason. Freddy. Chucky. In this Brookhaven mini movie, Sarah tells Molly there's a creepy monster that will get you if you look in the mirror at 3 a.m. Molly doesn't believe her, of course. Molly and her best friend Brookie decide to take the 3 a.m. challenge anyway and look in the mirror just to prove bully Sarah wrong. But Brookie sleeps through the alarm clock and Molly has to go by herself. When Molly looks in the mirror, something crazy happens. Watch to the end of this video to find out what it is. And guys, don't forget to like this video and comment below. We read all of your comments, guys. Oh, the alarm's going off already? Oh, it feels like I just fell asleep. Oh, well, guess it's time to get out of bed. Oh. Molly, time to wake up. Molly, Mo Molly? Where's my sister? She's up before me? What's going on? I better go downstairs and find out. Hmm.
This is a delicious waffle. A great way to start my day. Delicious. Molly, what's going on here? What's going on is that you better get ready for school. Or you're going to be late for the bus. But, but Molly, how did you get up before me? You'd never wake up before me like ever. <gasps> you're an imposter. You're not my real sister. <laughs> What, I can't turn over a new leaf, Daisy? I just wanted to be on, on time at school today. What? You never want to be on time. For that matter, you've had detention ten times already this week for not being on time. Ten times? Daisy, there's only five days in the school week. How could I have detention ten times? Okay, well, you know what I mean. So seriously, who are you? And what have you done with my sister? Daisy, I'm just excited about school, okay? Mm. This waffle's great. Excited about school? Now I know you must be sick. You got a bonk on your head, didn't you? No, I just really am excited. You better get out of those pajamas or we're going to be late for school. Hmm, excited about school. <gasps> I know, it must be pizza day. <laughs> yeah, it is pizza day. That explains everything. You love pizza day. Also, today is early dismissal, so I only have to be at school for like two hours. Oh my gosh, I forgot about early dismissal. Hmm. This apple's good. Well, that explains it. I was gonna say, uh, I knew you weren't excited about the science test. Science test? Just kidding. It's a math test. Math test? Oh, man, I didn't study. Well, I better get ready for school. It's a half day, which is pretty exciting. I mean, I love school and stuff, but everybody needs a half day once in a while. Maybe we could have a sleepover. That would be amazing. <laughs> la, 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 la. My name is Daisy, just like the flower. Daisy, come on! The bus is here! The bus is here! Okay, class. Uh, no looking on each other's papers. This is a graded math test. I hope you all studied. Oh, no! I didn't study! Good thing these problems seem pretty easy. Seems like today is my day. Pizza for lunch, early dismissal, easy math problems. Molly, quiet. There's no talking during a test. Yeah, Molly, no talking. You too, Daisy. I wouldn't want to give you detention. Hey, detention? Um, no, I was just telling Molly to be quiet. Okay, Daisy, well, you be quiet too, okay? Okay, Mr. Smith. <laughs> Goody two-shoes, Daisy got in trouble. Daisy got in trouble. Molly, do you want detention? You'll have to stay after early dismissal. Holy guacamole! No, I don't want to stay here after dismissal. <laughs> That'd be funny. Okay, time's up, everybody. Time to hand in your test. Wow, that was a piece of cake. Attention, students. As you all know, today is an early dismissal, so you're free to go. Have a great afternoon. Maybe you could do some extra studying. <laughs> Extra studying. She's funny. Come on, Molly, let's go. Hold on, Daisy. I have to use the bathroom really quick. Hurry up, Molly, seriously. Uh, yeah, I told you I'll be at the mall at 3 o'clock. Duh. Oh, hey, Sarah. Uh, hey, Lily. Whatever. You're not popular. Don't talk to us. Fine. Cheapers, creepers, rude. So, did you hear about this new 3 a.m. challenge? What? No. I haven't heard anything about this, Sarah. What are you talking about? Is this some sort of cheerleading ch challenge? No. <laughs> Apparently, there's this monster that lives in Brookhaven. Wait, what? Oh my gosh. Totally listening to their conversation right now. <laughs> yeah, there's a monster. And if you look in your mirror at 3 a.m., it comes out and it gets you. What? That sounds so creepy, Sarah. Oh, M G. Yeah, so whatever you do, do not take a dare to look in your mirror at 3 a.m. Well, is it, it just in the school mirror? Because we're not even in school at 3 a.m. No, it's in any mirror in Brookhaven at 3 a.m. So even if you want to check your hair in the middle of the night to make sure it looks amazing, don't do it. Well, I could use like my makeup compact mirror. <laughs> That's way too small for a monster to be in. This monster is magic. It can come out of any mirror that it wants. Oh my gosh. That sounds terrifying, Sarah. Holy guacamole, that sounds terrifying. Uh, were you listening on our conversation? Uh, yeah, I was using the bathroom and it was kind of hard not to hear. I mean, a monster that comes out of a mirror at 3 a.m.? Yeah, I totally believe her, right? Um, I don't know. It sounds really scary, but I don't think I believe you, Sarah. What? But I'm popular. You should believe me. Uh, just because you're popular doesn't mean you don't lie. Well, she has a point, Sarah. I'm not lying. The 3 a.m. monster is real. My brother saw it and thankfully he got away oh mg that sounds terrifying sarah are you mocking me right now uh-huh i sure am well 
do yourself a favor and at 3 a.m. see if you can look in the mirror at your house tonight and the monster will take care of you. Uh -huh, sure it will, Sarah. Bye! 3 a.m. monster mirror. Monster coming out of a mirror. That <laughs> sounds ridiculous. Whoa! It got dark really fast. Let's get you in the bathroom forever. It looks like we're going to get a storm, actually. Holy guacamole, I guess so. <laughs> Those are some dark storm clouds. We better get home, Miley, before the rain hits. Good idea, Daisy. Good idea. Wow, I thought early dismissal would be more fun. But since it's like storming outside, I can't do anything. I just, I'm just watching these cute videos of a llama, but it's stuck on this picture because the internet is out. Oh, man. Can't even watch TV or anything because of this giant storm. Hey, wait a minute. I have an idea. Hello? Oh, hey, Molly. <laughs> What's up? Hey, Brookie. How you doing with this giant storm? Oh, it's so boring at my house right now. Yeah, mine too. The internet's out. TV doesn't work. Good thing the cell phone still works. Hey, anyway, I was wondering, do you want to come over for a sleepover? I have sort of a challenge that I need my best friend for. I'd love to, Molly. Uh, just give me a minute to pack my bag and I'll be over. Okay, well, don't forget your umbrella because there's some serious rain coming down outside. Don't worry, Molly. I will. See you soon. Bye. Hey, Guess what, Daisy? Guess what? What? What's going on? Brookie's coming over for a sleepover. We're going to do a challenge. A challenge? What kind of challenge? You'll see. Oh, Brookie's here. Molly, hurry. It's 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 really storming outside. Come on in, Brookie. Whoa. Looks like you packed for a week. Are you staying for one night or did you move in? <laughs> this is just all my stuff. I got my sleeping bag in here. My pajamas, some snacks. Ooh, snacks. Did you bring cupcakes? Ew, Molly, she's not going to pack cupcakes in a suitcase that get all smushed. But I love cupcakes. Delicious cupcakes. Uh, Molly, snap out of it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I was just dreaming about cupcakes. She's always dreaming about cupcakes. All right, well, I guess the first thing we should do is eat a snack because dreaming about cupcakes made me super hungry. Who wants an ice cream? I do. I'm going to do some studying and then I'll hang out with you guys. Studying? Daisy, come on, live a little. Okay, fine. I'll get an ice cream with you guys. Brookie, do you want an ice cream? Um, yeah, but could you scoop it for me? Sure. I'll scoop some for you. Whoa, this two scoops of ice cream is delicious. What are the two flavors? Mmm, tastes like cookie dough. Good guess. Cookie dough and molten chocolate lava. One of my favorites right now. Ooh, molten lava chocolate is one of my favorites too. Well, what should we do now? Well, it's storming outside, so we can't go in the pool. We could get in the hot tub. Why don't we do that? Sounds fun. Hopefully our ice cream doesn't melt though. <laughs> Last one in the hot tub is a rotten egg. <laughs> It's Brookie. Brookie's the rotten egg. I'm still getting my bathing suit on. Jeepers. Well, my ice cream's starting to melt. I've got to I've got to eat it faster. Mm, this is really good. Ah, brain freeze. Brain freeze. Ah! Molly, you're so funny. This is so much fun. I'm like super warm from the hot tub and super cold from the ice cream. Okay, let's turn on some bubbles. Ooh, turn on some purple lights too, Molly. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. I absolutely love sleepovers at you guys' house. It's so much fun. Ah! But it's getting really late. I'm ready for bed. Really? Already, Daisy? I am too. Uh, I wish that it wasn't storming so we could have went outside, but eating ice cream and hanging out in the hot tub was fun. Yeah, it sure was. Okay, well, let's put our pajamas on and get ready for bed, I guess. La 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 la. There, I'm all cozy in my PJs. Brookie, are you gonna come up to um to bed? Or are you just gonna hang out on the hot tub and sleep here? No, I was just waiting for you to get out of the bathroom, silly. <laughs> oh, yeah, that makes sense. Ah, this has been a super fun sleepover, but I haven't even told Brookie about the challenge yet. I wonder if she'll be afraid of the mirror monster. Oh, my gosh, Molly, we bought the same pajamas. <laughs> Aren't they adorable, though? They so are, and they're so comfy, too. Okay, where's your sleeping bag, Brookie? You can put it right here. Okay, Molly, sounds good. Um, so you said it on the phone you needed help with the challenge? Did you do the challenge by yourself? No, the challenge is in the middle of the night at 3 a.m. Wait, what? Yeah, basically, they're supposed to be a monster that comes out of your mirror. Wait, what? Yeah, Sarah was talking to her friend in the bathroom at school, and I overheard them, and then I asked her about it because I was b basically eavesdropping. Oh, Molly. Yeah, and guess what? She was telling her friend that if you look in any mirror in Brookhaven at 3 a.m., a monster will come out and get you. OMG, Molly, that sounds terrifying. Nah, I think she's just full of it. She's 
totally full of the beans. <laughs> <laughs> Molly, you're so silly. That's what I thought. I think that basically she's making it up. I think this is a very bad idea, Molly. D -d 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 Don't look in the mirror at, at 3 a.m. Nah, um, who's with me? Who's gonna look? Not me. I'm not getting out of bed at 3 a.m. to see a monster. No way. I will, Molly. Just wake me up, okay? Okay, I'll set my alarm for 2.55. Good night, Daisy. Good night, Molly. Good night, Brookie. Good night, Molly and Daisy. <laughs> Huh? What? Oh my gosh. It's it's 2.55 a.m. Okay, I've got to wake up Brookie. Ah, we have to look for the mirror monster that doesn't exist at 3 a.m. Just so I can prove Sarah's lying. Brookie! 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 Oh my gosh, she's sleeping. Brookie! 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 Come on, we have to go look at the mirror monster! Molly, go away. It's so late. I'm so tired. But Brookie, you're supposed to do this 3 a.m. challenge with me. Brookie! Oh my gosh, she's not going to wake up. Oh well, there's no such thing as a mirror monster in Brookhaven anyway. So I can go by myself. Yeah, I'm not afraid at all. Okay, Brookie, have fun sleeping. <laughs> now what mirror am I going to look in? I'll look in the upstairs bathroom mirror. Definitely not going to be anything in here. I'm not afraid. I I I'm not afraid at all. Mirror monster. Everybody knows Sarah's just a bully and she's full of beans. I don't see anything. Oh, mirror monster. Where are you? Pff, mirror monster. This is ridiculous. I don't know what Sarah was talking about. Pff, mirror monster. There's no mirror monster. <laughs> Wait till I tell everybody tomorrow that it was a total prank and Brookhaven is mirror monster free. <sighs> I'm going back to bed. How ridiculous. <laughs> Well, Brookie, you didn't miss anything by sleeping at 3 a.m. <laughs> no mirror monster here. <sighs> Time to get some sleep. Shh. Shh. <sighs> <sighs> what was that, that sound? It, it sounded so creepy. Is, is anybody there? Oh, it's just Brookie. Maybe she's snoring really weird or something. <laughs> that mirror monster's got me totally creeped out. Don't be ridiculous. I'm just gonna go back to sleep. It sounded like a creepy monster. At that time, I really did hear it. Uh, uh, there's, there's, there's nothing there. Oh my gosh. I know I heard something that time. I know I did. Okay, I'm just freaking out right now. This is ridiculous. Stop it, Molly. Seriously, stop it. Go to sleep. Uh, I, I swear I heard something really creepy. And I'm afraid to close my eyes. Okay, I, I know I'm just being ridiculous. I, I need to go back to sleep. Already? Holy guacamole, that night went really quick. Um, Brookie, wake up. You don't want to be late for school, do you? Uh, I'm still sleepy. Molly woke me up in the middle of the night. Oh, she actually did that challenge? I don't know. She actually said she was going to. Uh, I can't even open my eyes. I'm so tired right now. Well, we better wake her up or she's going to be late for school. As usual. Okay, uh, I'll go wake her up. Uh, Molly! Molly, it's... Molly? Daisy, she's not up here. What? Yes, she is. No, she's not. Look for yourself. What? M Molly? Oh, maybe she just got up early again today. No, you don't understand. Today is not a pizza day, and it's not early dismissal. She would not get up out of bed for anything. What? No, I'm sure she's just downstairs. You don't understand. Something really weird's going on here. Oh, my God, Daisy. 
You don't think the 3 a.m. mirror monster got her? What? No, of course not. <laughs> I don't know. Something seems really weird. I kept hearing these weird rattling sounds in the night. I thought it was just Molly had gas from eating all that ice cream, but maybe it was a monster. OMG. Do you think so, Blucky? I don't know, but I, I just want my best friend back. Molly? Molly? Where, where, where are you? In this Roblox Brookhaven mini movie, Molly and Daisy get a new neighbor in Brookhaven. Molly doesn't believe bratty Sarah, who tells her that her new neighbor is none other than Circus Baby. Sarah dares her to go inside the creepy house next door to find out. But will Molly find out that it's truly Circus Baby and be in trouble? Watch this crazy Roblox story all the way to the end of the video to find out. And guys, don't forget to like this video and comment below. <laughs> <laughs> this is hilarious. Molly, Molly. Molly, what are you doing? Why are you wearing a bathing suit? <laughs> because, Daisy, today is the day. We're going to go to the water park. Molly, we're going to the water park? It's 7 o'clock in the morning. I know, but I'm so excited. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Well, what are you doing on the computer then? Um, I'm ordering tickets to go to the water park. It's not free, you know. Really? Because it looks like you're, we you're totally watching funny raccoon videos. And you're wearing a bathing suit while you're doing it. Okay, well, I got a little sidetracked. <laughs> and I'm watching these funny videos. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at this raccoon. Molly, if we're gonna go to the water park, we have to get serious and buy the tickets. A lot of people want to go, you know. <laughs> look at this raccoon. <laughs> he is pretty funny. Okay, no, but get serious. Let's buy the tickets. Okay, fine. La, 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 la. Okay, I'm just gonna take the money out of the bank and transfer it over to the water park. Done! Our tickets are bought. Are we ready to go? I can't believe it. Our first time to go to the water park this entire summer. Oh, it's been such a cold winter. All I wanted to do was go to the water park. Yeah, but if you went to the water park in the winter, you'd be sorry. Well, I'm just saying I'd go down an ice slide. Oh, that sounds freezing and fun. Hey, guys. Um, I just want to tell you something crazy. Brookie, calm down. What, what's going on? Did you just eat a bunch of candy bars again? No, I learned my lesson the last time after I ate all of those. And then I was like, Bleh! all over the place. It was so gross. Ew, you threw up all the candy bars? Um, yeah, sort of. <laughs> well, okay, so why are you acting so crazy? Oh, M, G, I just heard that you have a new neighbor that moved in next door. Really? Oh my gosh, are they famous? Um, no, <laughs> they're creepy. What? Creepy? Nah, <laughs> this is a really nice neighborhood. Why would there be somebody really creepy moving in? Yeah, so far all of our neighbors are so nice and so cool. Yeah, well this one isn't. This one is super creepy. Guys, you need to be careful. What? What are you talking about? Is this a prank? Would I prank you about this? No, I want my friends to be safe. Wow, maybe she's being serious. Okay, wait a minute. Hold on a second. Where did you hear this information from? Um, well, uh... Okay, uh, who did you hear it from, Brookie? I heard it from... Okay, this doesn't mean that it's not true. You guys still need to be safe. Who did you hear it from? Uh, Sarah. What?! But Sarah doesn't even like us. Of course she'd make up crazy rumors just to freak us out. Yeah, Molly has a point, Pookie. I think that probably everything's just fine. No, she said she said strange things have been going on at that house. Guys, I, I, I'm serious. It just even looks creepy. Well, maybe they're vampires. Okay, that's not funny. They might actually be vampires. Guys, I think you should lock your doors and stay home, like, forever. What? That's gonna be like another quarantine. I don't think so. Uh -huh. I'm going to the water park. I've been looking forward to this all winter long. Yeah, me too. I was even dreaming about ice slides. <laughs> ice slides. Brookie, I'm sure Sarah was just making it up. Now, I'm sorry, but we have already paid for our tickets at the water park. We're going! Ah, this is the life. Tell me about it, Molly. This was the best idea you had, like, ever. The water park is amazing. Daisy, you want to get in the pool? I just want to chill right now and just get, like, some fresh air and, I don't know, relax. Well, I'm going to get in the pool. Suit yourself if you want to just lay there all day and be lame. Molly, don't be rude. Okay, fine. However you want to enjoy the water park. But I'm going to be in the water pretty much all day. Oh, yeah. Ah. <sighs> 
could live at the water park. Seriously, I totally could. Hey, what's that guy doing with that that pool noodle? I want a pool noodle. Hey, Tommy, where'd you get that from? Could I have a pool noodle too? No. <laughs> yeah, you're not popular enough to have a pool noodle. What? Yeah. They're only giving them out to the popular kids. Yeah, and if you're a lifeguard. Ow! Did you, seriously, did you just hit me with that pool noodle? Yeah, quit asking if you can have a pool noodle. You're not cool enough to have a pool noodle. Okay, point taken, Tommy. But you didn't have to hit me with the pool noodle. That's kind of rude, right? Yeah, that was rude. Don't hit Molly. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Ow! Hit me again! Ow. Okay, this guy is being so rude. Oh, look who it is. Oh, look who it is. It's Sarah. It's Molly. It's Sarah. It's Molly. Sarah! Molly. Sarah! Molly. Sarah! Whatever. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I can't believe we're at the same water park. Ugh. Maybe if I get in the pool, she just won't realize I'm even here. Molly, do you want to go down some water slides? I sure do, Daisy. Let's do this. Which one should we go down first? I'm still here. Whatever. We're trying to enjoy our water park day. Daisy, come on. We have to go down some slides. Molly, where are you going? That's to the snack hut. Ooh, snacks. Molly, we got to go down some water slides first. Cheapos, you're always thinking about your stomach. Ooh, cupcakes. Molly. All right, fine. I'm done thinking about cupcakes. da 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 <laughs> Molly, you're either thinking about cupcakes or singing some weird song. It's pretty much my life. You're not thinking what I think you're thinking. I don't know, Molly. What am I thinking? You're thinking we're going to get in these cannons and get shot across the water park. That's exactly right, Molly. Let's do this. Um, uh, Daisy? Whee! <laughs> Come on, Molly. Don't be a chicken. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> that was so much fun. Holy guacamole. Ow! Oh, my gosh. Whoa, are they having, like, a battle in the air? Oh, Molly, I got hit by that guy. I'm with the pool noodle. Me too. Ow, what are they doing? What, has he got a blow dryer? <laughs> How is he flying around in here? I didn't know that people could fly in the water park. Yeah, me either, Molly, but I think he might be some sort of super villain or something, and we should probably stay away from him. Daisy, are you just going to go to the cannon again? Yeah, but if you go to the other cannon, I think it'll shoot you up to a water slide. That's what I think. Okay, well, we could try it. Let's do this. Okay, we're gonna speed walk. Whoa. <laughs> YouTube magic is super cool. All right, me first. Me first, Molly. Me first. Molly, ouch. Whoa. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm getting dizzy. Holy guacamole. Oh my gosh, where am I gonna land? Ah, ah, ow, I just ran into something. What? Wait, where, where am I? Oh my gosh! Ah! 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 Oh, uh, guys, I landed out into the desert. Uh, this isn't good. Molly, where are you? Oh, MG. It's also starting to get dark, which means it's kind of creepy out here. That didn't go as planned. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was a super long run. Molly, where have you been? Okay, that cannon shot me out into the middle of the desert. I've been running for so long. Molly, it's been like five minutes. That seems like forever. I need a cupcake. I'm dying. I need a cupcake. Seriously, Molly, you're being very dramatic right now. Huh. Uh, you have no idea what I've been through. The desert! It changes you! It changes you! Molly, get up right now so we can go down a water slide. It could be so ridiculous. Not until I have a cupcake. Fun! I'm gonna have lots of fun without you. Okay, whatever. I'm getting up. Wait for me. <laughs> Thought you'd change your mind! Whoa! I can't see anything. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, my gosh. Whoa. <laughs> oh, this is going to make a huge splash at the end. I just know it. I don't even see Daisy. Wait, I think I just saw her. Nope, nope, I didn't. Whoa. <laughs> Molly, that was great. Holy guacamole. This is so much fun. Ugh, these losers don't even know what kind of trouble they're in. Ugh. I guess I'll have to tell them. Oh, hey, Sarah, you're back again. That's right. I never left. And look, losers, I have something really important to tell you. Well, if you want us to actually listen, maybe don't call us losers. That's rude. Okay, whatever. Hey, I love your videos. Oh, my gosh, I'm a big fan. Oh, thank you so much.
much. That's really nice of you to say. Uh, hello? I'm trying to get your attention here. Okay, Sarah, what is it? Your neighbor is Circus Baby. What? <laughs> That's the funniest thing I've ever heard. It's true. I saw her with my own eyes. She is so evil. Oh my gosh. You guys are all gonna die if you're not careful. What? Sarah, you're always trying to prank us. You're so rude. You're nothing but a bully. Yes, Sarah, seems like you have nothing better to do with your time than to harass us always. I'm telling you that it's circus, baby. If you don't believe me, check it out for yourself. Unless, of course, you're chicken. I'm not chicken. I I I'll go. I'll go. All right. Go knock on our door then and see what happens. Molly, I don't know about this. No, I'm sure Sarah's pranking me. Everything will be fine. Yeah. I'm sure of it. <laughs> You'll see. You'll see. Holy guacamole, it's raining cats and dogs out here. I think the whole town's gonna flood. Molly, yeah, that's nice. Uh, I'm trying to tell you something really important, though. More important than the entire town flooding? Molly, that house over there looks really creepy. Hey, wait, let me borrow some of your umbrella. Molly, stop it, you're pushing me out in the way. Where's your own umbrella? I don't have one. <laughs> oh, brother. You're never prepared, Molly. Yeah, but that's why I have a sister like you, because you are. Anyway, Molly, I don't think you should go in that haunted house. Maybe Silkis Baby really does live in there. Nonsense, Daisy. That house isn't that creepy. Well, uh, yeah, okay, it's a little creepy. What's up with the lights on the inside? This looks like something Silkis Baby would love, Molly. <sighs> well, Sarah dared me, so I'm gonna do it. Oh, Molly, I think this is a bad idea. Don't worry, I'll be back in one second. Once I prove that, you know, it's not Circus Baby's house. <laughs> What was that? That sounded creepy. Molly, don't do it. Don't go in there. I, I can't. I have to. I have to prove it's not circus, baby. <laughs> yeah, come inside. <laughs> uh, okay, you want to make me some popcorn or maybe some cupcakes? <laughs> sure. Then let's play. Uh, okay. Well, here goes nothing. Whoa, this place seems kind of creepy. I mean, what is that on the wall right there? Wanna play hide and seek? Ah! Oh my god! It really is circus, baby! Oh my gosh, Sarah wasn't lying! Okay, if I hide in this closet, she won't see me. Wait a minute, this isn't a closet. It just goes around behind. I'm gonna make a break for it. Wait, maybe I should go in here. She'll never know. Okay, I don't think she saw me. Yeah, she definitely didn't. <laughs> where are you? Oh my gosh, she doesn't know where I am. Okay, I can make a break for it. I can make a break for it! <laughs> Come back! Here. Oh my gosh. No, I'm, I'm going to go outside. I can make it. Wait a minute. This this doesn't look like Brookhaven. <laughs> That's because I can change space and time. <laughs> now let's play. I don't want to play. No. Oh my gosh. I feel weird. What's happening to me? What's happening to me? Ah! <laughs> I'm plushy baby. Oh, <laughs> you're so cute. Now let's send you back to your own time in Brookhaven and see what kind of trouble you can get in. <laughs> oh, mama, mama. What? No, I'm not your mama. <laughs> We're both babies. But you're so big. So? I'm a big baby. Don't be rude. You eat too many cupcakes. What? No, I don't. Rude! Yeah, I'm definitely sending you back to Brookhaven, you little brat! What? Oh, not nice! Not nice! Oh my gosh, I'm so worried. Why hasn't she come out yet? Uh, Daisy, why are you standing in front of that creepy circus baby's house? Because Molly went in there, Brookie! What? She... She went into Circus Baby's house? Is she crazy? She didn't believe you or Sarah that Circus Baby was our new neighbor and, and she went in there and she never came out. Well, she's a goner. There's nothing we can do. What? She's your best friend. We have to do something. <laughs> Whoa, what was that? It sounded like a creepy baby. Um, I'm pretty sure that I don't want to stick around. Blackie! I'm sorry, I'm too afraid. <laughs> Time to cause some mischief. Molly, what, what, what happened to you? Who's Molly? 
I'm Circus Baby's new little friend. What? Oh, Molly, this can't be. Tell me, tell me it's not true. <laughs> it is true. <laughs> now, where's the bank? I've got to rob it. <laughs> what, 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 what was that? Oh, my gosh. It was Circus Baby. I knew it. <laughs> Striking fear in the hearts of everyone in Brookhaven. <laughs> First, I think I'm going to go to the grocery store. I'm starving. And just so you know, Circus Baby doesn't pay for her food. Ooh, look, nobody's around. I'm going to eat all these Doritos. Then I'm going to eat all the chips. Mm. So good. <laughs> Ooh, Reese Cups. One of my favorites. Mm. So good. Oh my gosh, there's Circus Baby. I mean, Molly. And she's stealing bunches of stuff. Huh? What? Is somebody in here? Oh my gosh, I gotta hide. Where should I hide? I'm a tail bullet hiding. I knew it. You've been following me. Nope, nope. I'm just here to get my groceries. Don't want any problems, Circus Baby. C -c Go about your business. Oh my gosh, I've got to find a way to turn Molly back. Now, where's the bank? Ooh, there's a police station. Don't want to go that way. Mm. As soon as I get done eating this delicious Reese cup, <gasps> there's the bank! <laughs> Circus Baby had a rampage in Brookhaven. It's the best day ever. Okay, here we go. I've got the manager information. All I have to do is hack this computer and all the money will come out of the ATM. <laughs> I'm recording you, Circus Baby, and I'm going to put your crime on YouTube. Cool! I'll be famous! <laughs> what? No, no, that's not the reaction I wanted. Okay, where's my cell phone? I'm going to have to look up a spell. I've never done a spell before because I'm not a witch, but I'm going to have to learn it because my sister, she's circus baby. There has to be a spell that we force this. Okay, um, yeah, my iPad will work. Um, how to turn your sister back to herself. Okay, here it goes nothing. Alakazam, Alakazoo, turn back to you. Molly? Oh no, this spell from Google didn't work. I knew I wasn't a powerful enough witch to do this spell. I mean, you're no longer circus baby, but now you're just a regular baby. Oh, brother, what am I going to do now? Did somebody say baby? I love babies. What? Who said that? Ah, it's circus baby. Holy guacamole. Please don't hurt me. I don't want to hurt you. I just want the baby. Oh, wait a minute. Did you turn my sweet little circus baby that I made into this monster? Uh, well, that monster you're talking about is my little, my sister Molly. And, well, now she's my little sister, but she was my older sister. But you turned her into a circus baby, and then I used a spell to turn her back. And now she's just a regular baby. This is getting very confusing. I can't believe that you cursed my beautiful little baby. What? She's not your baby. You can't have my baby. She's mine. What? No, that's my sister Molly. Circus baby, you give her back to me. I don't think so. <laughs> She's mine. She's mine. She's mine. She's mine. <laughs> Circus baby, please give me back my sister. I don't think so. Quit following me or I'll make you the circus baby too. What? No, I don't want to be a circus baby. Please, but my sister. Ooh, ice cream. I love ice cream. What kind do I want? Ooh, bubble gum. Hey, circus baby, I have to tell you something. What? what? What's that? Is that another baby? That's right. Another baby you can turn into circus baby. Here you go. Ooh, I love babies. Ooh, wait a minute. What is this? This isn't a real baby. It's a fake. Come on, Molly. We got to get out of here. What? But this isn't a real baby. It's just a doll. Come back here. Oh, I'm going to get you. <sighs> We're home, Molly. 
don't worry, I locked the door. And then now we just have to figure out how to how to change you back to yourself. Yes, you can watch TV if you want, but we have to call the police because Circus Baby is still on the loose and she's gonna be looking for us. 911, what's your emergency? Hello, I need help. Circus Baby is on a rampage. Oh, uh, Circus Baby, seriously? Yes, just believe me, okay? I live at 15 Brookhaven Lane. Get here quick! Make sure you lock all your doors. We'll be there as soon as possible. Okay, Molly. We're gonna be okay. The police are on their way. Did somebody say police? Ah! Circus Baby's at our house! The police are coming. You, 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 just stay back! <laughs> now I can turn you both into Circus Babies. <laughs> <laughs> Wanna play? Yes! Pizza again! Molly, if you eat any more pizza, you're gonna turn into a pizza. Ooh, then I'd be totally delicious. Mmm, <laughs> I'm so good. Mm, I love it. I'm not having pizza. I packed my lunch. Ugh, boring. Pizza's delicious. And they're having Doritos and soda. I prefer to eat more healthy things, Molly. And all they have is a banana and an apple. I've had that for the last three days. I had to take matters into my own hands and pack my own lunch. Hmm, pizza's delicious. Hey guys, what's up? When have you ever called us guys? You always call us losers. Yeah, mm. this pizza's so good. I don't even care if you call me a loser. You guys are losers? No. <laughs> I was totally kidding about that. I'm turning over a new leaf. Wow, that's amazing, Sarah. You're not going to be a bully anymore? That's great. Well, I wouldn't say that, but I'm trying. Well, we'll see about that. Molly, don't be rude. She's trying her best. Yeah, duh. Anyway, here, Daisy, this is for you. Wow, a present for me? But, Sarah, it's not even my birthday. Uh, Daisy, that box says don't open ever. Oh, no, no. I just wrote that on there so that no one else would take your very special present, Daisy. Oh, wow, Sarah. You really have turned over a new leaf. Um, I'd be happy to take your present. Don't do it! She's, she's probably got fireworks in there or something. Uh, Molly, don't be crazy right now. Sarah is trying to be nice. Okay, I I'll take the present. Only one rule. Um, don't open it till you get home. I don't want any of the other students to get jealous. Oh, of course, of course. Thanks, Sarah. No problem, loser. I mean, friend. <laughs> Daisy, something seems weird about this. Molly, only you would think a present was weird. You're not actually going to open that, are you, Daisy? Of course I am, Molly. Why? Because it says don't open ever. I think that's a very distinctive warning. I, it was just so that nobody opened my present. Daisy, think about this. Why would Sarah the bully give you a present? That's that's not normal. Something in my gut tells me this is this is not okay. This is not right. Marty, people can turn over new leaves, okay? What does that even mean? Like, you find a new leaf and, like, you turn it over? Yeah, Marty, it means that people can change. And maybe Sarah is. Let's just see what's in the box. It's probably a scorpion or a, a rattlesnake. Molly, you're being ridiculous. Okay, I'm opening it. Whoa, it's a doll! And it's animatronic! Um, has anybody else noticed that it's kind of creepy? Molly, okay, maybe she's not the prettiest doll, but every doll deserves love. Even this one. What are you going to name her? Um, I don't know. Maybe I'll name her Lilith. That seems like a nice name, right? Oh, look, she waves! Does she talk? Let me look at her back and see if there's a button for talk. Well, there is, but it seems that it's broken. It's okay, Lilith. Even a doll like you needs to be loved. Ah, she laughs, too. Oh, that's kind of creepy. Molly, don't say mean things about my doll! Now, come on, it's time for bed. I'll take Lilith, and she can stay in the bedroom with us. Does she have to? She's so creepy. Molly, it's my doll! Okay, fine. Guess she can sleep in the bedroom with us. Creepy doll. I have bad feelings about that doll. I really do. You can sleep here tonight, Lilith. Right on top of my dresser, okay? Um, I'm really tired, though, so we'll play in the morning. 
Daisy, you're talking to that doll like it's real. I'm just pretending, Molly. Jeez. I'm sorry Sarah didn't give you a present. I'm not. I don't want one of those creepy dolls. Ugh. Hmm. I'm feeling super hungry. I hate when my stomach rumbles at 3 a.m. Huh, but there's no ignoring it. I have to wake up or I won't be able to fall back asleep because my stomach is totally my master. <laughs> oh, look at Daisy. She looks so cute. Wait a minute. Is she drooling? Ew, gross. Oh, go get some waffles. That'll make my stomach stop grumbling. Hey, wait a minute. Where's Daisy's doll? I thought she left it right there. Hmm. Oh, well. I hope there's lots of waffles because I'm starving. Ooh, we do have some waffles left. Ooh, this is going to be delicious. Hmm. This is so good. I just want to play. Ah! Ooh, what was that? The lights went out and, and then I heard something. That was so creepy. Okay, it's, it was probably just nothing. It's probably just a little power surge. Okay, I'll just put down my waffle. Turn the lights back on. Okay. <sighs> okay, let's see. I'm just eat a little bit more waffle. I'm sure it was nothing. I seriously could eat all of the waffles in the entire world. Ah, <sighs> now to get some sleep. Wait a minute. I don't... I don't remember that doll being there before. When I went downstairs, wasn't that doll missing? <sighs> I'm probably just tired. It was probably there the whole time. Ah, bed is so comfy. Ah, morning already? Daisy, Daisy, it's time to wake up. Marty, I'm so tired today. Come on, you've got your new doll. Don't you want to play? That's right, my new doll. Totally. I won't even tell you about this creepy thing that happened to me last night. Whatever, Marty, you're just making it up. OMG, I love these panda videos. They're so adorable. Not as adorable as my little doll. Um, Daisy, I hate to break it to you, but there's nothing adorable about that doll. Well, I think I'm going to repaint her face till she looks cute. Then, I mean, I'll dye her hair. Her outfit's already pretty cute. Hello? Is anyone to let me in or what? Oh, Sarah, what are you doing at my house? Can I come in, please? Yeah, sure. The door's unlocked. Come on in. Are you going to call us losers? No, I called you my friends, remember? I just came to see how your new doll is doing. Oh, she's doing great! I love her. I mean, she's super nice and I... Yeah, she's not at all creepy. <laughs> no, not at all. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I see that. Has she said anything yet? No, it appears that she's kind of broken. I tried, like, um, pulling the switch on the back of her back, but it doesn't work. It's okay, I still like her. Although I think I'm going to repaint her face. <laughs> Why is she laughing right now? It's like she can hear what we say. Don't be ridiculous, Molly. I don't know how ridiculous I'm being, but that doll seems creepy. In my gut, it says so. Well, Sarah, don't listen to my sister. I'm just so grateful you gave me this present. Yeah, sure. Um, Just don't play with that doll at 3 a.m. What? Uh, nothing. I'll see you later. <laughs> Have fun with your new doll. Thanks, Sarah. You really are turning into a friend. Uh, how do I turn this thing off? Molly! Okay, I, I, switched the, I switched the off switch. Molly, you killed her! Daisy, I just turned her off. Ooh, she's so creepy. <sighs> Molly, I can't believe this day is almost over. It's almost time for bed. Yeah, I know. Well, that doll should sleep down here. No, Molly. The doll's gonna sleep with me in my room. Fine. Good night, Lilith. It was so awesome spending time with you today. Um, yeah. Super awesome and stuff. Hopefully that doll doesn't come to life. Molly, ugh, you're so weird. Just go to bed already. Fine. I am very tired. Ah. <sighs> Oh no, not again. My stomach's always growling at 3 a.m. 
Fine, stomach. I know you're the boss of me, so I'll get up and have a waffle. Well, I guess having a waffle's not so bad. Just one night, I'd like to sleep without having to wake up. Oh, and gee, that doll is so creepy in the dark. My sister doesn't even think it's creepy at all. I don't, I don't know why she can't see it. I think you're creepy. I think you're really creepy. Okay, okay, stomach, I'm going. La 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 la. Mmm, this waffle's delicious. I just want to play. What was that? What, 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 what was that? I just heard someone say, I just want to play. That was so creepy. And the light went out again. The same thing happened to me last night. Oh my god, this is starting to get really, really creepy. Oh, that's better. I don't like being down here in the dark. Ah! Ah, that's the doll! How'd the doll get down here? Ah, that's so creepy! Daisy! 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 Molly, why are you yelling? What's your problem? Your doll! It was down on the counter! What? What are you talking about? My doll is right where I left it. Wait, what? Huh? But I just saw it down on the counter. What are you talking about, Molly? Are you okay? Did you fall out of the top bunk and get a bunk on your head? Maybe I was just sleepwalking. I remember waking up and being hungry for a waffle and seeing the doll on the end of your bed and going down to the kitchen and she wasn't there and then she was and now she's here. Molly, just go to bed. You're very tired. Oh, you're probably right, Daisy. You're probably right. It's okay, Molly. Everybody has a bad dream now and again. <laughs> Daisy, it's been a super long week at school. I cannot wait to go to Chuck E. Cheese, have some pizza, play some games, and just chill. I know what you mean, Molly. It has been a rough week. Whoa, watch it, Chucky. Cheapers, didn't we just say we had a rough week and you're already running into us? Oh, Daisy, sounds like you need a piece of pizza. You sound hangry. Well, I am kind of hungry. I noticed. You're very grumpy. Chucky was just trying to say hi. Yeah, right. He was getting up in my face about it. <laughs> Daisy, it's going to be fine. Let's just get some pizza, some soda, and then we can play the favorite game of all, the claw. I'm going to win a prize today if it's the last thing I do. is the best pizza in the world. I have to agree, Molly. It is very good. Hmm. I cannot get enough of this pizza. I think I've eaten like a hundred slices. Hmm. Oh, 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 oh. Ew, Molly, that boop smells like the sewer. Yeah, but now I have a lot more room for more slices of pizza. <laughs> mm. So good. Oh, Molly. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, we're Chucky. Hi, we're Chucky. Welcome to Chuck E. Cheese. Molly, is it just me? Or is this show they put on with the big robot guys a little creepy? Yeah, and apparently they have more than one Chucky now. Look at them all up on stage. Oh, wait a minute. The curtain just dropped. Um, but I can still see their noses, which is probably a glitch. And they need to fix that right away because it's really creepy. Totally. Let's get out of here. I'm done with my pizza. We can play some games. Okay. La, 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 la. So many games. What am I going to play first? Ooh, there's a fishing game. There's skee-ball. Ooh, skee-ball. That sounds like so much fun. Molly, um, there's a creepy burger guy following me. What? A creepy burger guy? What are you talking about? There's no burger guy. We're not at McDonald's. Yeah, but they are, Molly. It's just Chucky. And besides, we all know you were kind of grumpy with Chuck E. Cheese. No, Molly, seriously. What's behind you? Ugh! That burger guy is kind of creepy. It's all right. Let's just go in the other room and play the crane game. Maybe he won't follow us. I hope you're right, Molly. I hope you're right. Holy guacamole! They've gotten so many more crane games! Oh, wow. This one looks amazing. I want to turn next. I definitely want to turn next. <laughs> 
Are you done? Are you done yet? Molly, don't be rude. She's still playing. All right, here we go, guys. I cannot wait to try this game. She's already on to the other one, but this one doesn't seem to be working. Let me just see if I can get it to work. All right, there we go. Wait, is it working? Molly, I think this one um, might be broken. What? No, it's not broken. Don't say that. Never say it's broken. Molly, just try a different one. But I want a Kush ball. They're so cool. All right, fine. I'll go try this one. Cool crane. Four tickets. Holy guacamole. I can afford four tickets. I have like 100 from Chuck E. Cheese. Just have to put in my card. And don't tell me this one's broken too. Okay, no. Good. All right, guys. Here I go. I'm going to move the claw over. I have to drop it right at the right time. Molly, I'll help you decide when it's the right time. No. I want to decide myself. All right, guys. I want one of these. Awesome little bears with the top hats. All right, I'm dropping it. Oh, no! Oh, I didn't win. No fair. That's the way the claw crumbles. <laughs> Maybe this one will work now, too. Oh, it does. Yes. Molly, when do I get a tune? All right, after me, Daisy. Okay, here we go. I'm moving the claw. I don't think it's moving, Molly. Well, it took my ticket to better move. Yeah, no, it's moving. All right, this is exciting. So exciting! I want a koosh ball so bad! Right, I'm dropping it. I think I might be better with this game than you. I think not, Daisy. Oh, come on! It rolled away! That wasn't fair! Maria, are you gonna keep playing this until all your tickets are gone? Yeah, pretty much. This is amazing. Alright, um, should I play this game again? Yes, I'm going to. Come on, I just need to get one of these. They're so cool. Right, I'm dropping it. Sometimes if you drop them in the corner, it works better. Because then the ball can't, like, roll away. <gasps> oh, my God. No! Oh, that's so unfair. All right. All right, I give up on that one. I'm going to go to a different one. Ooh, look at They have Kermits. They have, um, like, uh, Patrick from SpongeBob. This one looks really fun. DZ, are you going to try to? You're more obsessed with the claw than me, Molly, I have to say. Okay, DZ, go around the side of it and see if I'm in the right spot. Like, go over here and, and look. Okay, a little to the front and drop. Am I going to get, what am I going to get? Ooh, there's an Among Us toy in there, too. You could have gotten that pickle. Oh, I can't. I can't get anything, apparently. All right, let's try this one again. I'm not leaving until I get a toy. I want a toy. Maybe if you go all the way back in oval. Yeah, that, that seems like a good one. Seems like a good spot. What am I going to get? You almost had that pickle. Ay, ay, ay. This is so annoying. All right. Molly, why do you love it if it's so annoying to you? I don't know, because I just do. The, the chances you might get a toy are like, they're like zero. Molly, do you see that weird thing coming through the wall over there? What? No, I'm trying to, I'm trying to play the game. Okay, I'm dropping it. Come on, give me a toy. No! Molly, you're going to waste all your tickets. It's not a waste if you love the game. Guys, slam the like button if you think I can at least get one toy out of one of these crane games. Come on, guys. Believe in me, please. I, I need, like, just a little boost of confidence here because I feel like I'm not getting any toys. It's making me kind of sad. I'm wasting all my tickets. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. Ah! <laughs> You're being crazy right now. All right. Let me take a try. All right. Here you go, Daisy. Come on, Daisy. You can do this. You can do this. You can do this. I'm going for it, Molly. I'm going for it. I'm telling you, I am obsessed with the crane game in real life. Now I know I can play it for free on Roblox. I've been doing this all the time. Did you get it, Daisy? Oh! Oh my gosh, Daisy, you almost got that. All right, let me try. Ay, yeah, yeah, Molly. I don't think you can. It's just going to keep taking your tickets. No! I don't understand. I'm obsessed with this. I must. Okay, Molly, you lined up like perfectly. Yeah, I think so. I think I can get that like little like noob or whatever he is. I don't know. Molly! Oh, you didn't get him. No. This silly game. Oh, oh. Molly, don't kick it. That's not going to help. Well, it keeps stealing all my tickets and, and, and it's broken. <laughs> uh, Molly, there's something really evil behind me, isn't there? Ah, it's that creepy burger guy. You think my games are dumb? Well, what do you think about this? Daisy, I think he's putting us inside the claw machine. Uh-oh, Molly. He's evil. <laughs> ah, Daisy, help. Molly, be careful. Run. Daisy, it's it's too late for me. <laughs> what just happened to me?
me. Oh my gosh. I'm in the claw game. OMG. I'm one of the prizes and... Ah! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I just got collected. Money. We got put inside the claw game. Oh my gosh. That burger head was really evil. Molly, I can't believe this. What prizes? Uh, yeah, this is probably not good. And look at that claw. It's pinchy, pinchy. Ouchie, ouchie. I knew it was a bad idea to come to Chuck E. Cheese. This is making me fairly upset. I can't figure out why I have such a big head. Is it because I have such a big brain? I doubt that, Molly. Oh, very funny, Daisy. Um, look, we're not toys. We're not prizes. Let us out of here. I don't think she can hear us, Molly. And I think she wants a prize. She's obsessed with the claw, just like you are. Well, she can't get us. Look at her. She's terrible at the claw. Why are you just, like, going right there? You have to move the claw. Don't help her, Molly. We'll be her next prize. Um, yeah, that that's, that's probably a bad thing, huh? Well, Molly, maybe we can find a way to escape here. I don't know, Daisy. I think the only way to escape is to be collected. Oh, no. I don't want to be someone's prize. Hey, this guy's rude. This other toy in here is, like, beating me up with a, with a baseball bat. What? Where's my baseball bat? Don't I get one? I apparently not, Marty. Just that guy. <laughs> ah! Oh, no! She almost got me. The claw cannot get me, Daisy. Ah! Too late. She's collected me. Well, hopefully she's nice, Marty. Um, have a nice life. Daisy, as soon as she collects me and puts me down into that thing, I'm out of here, Daisy. I'm out of here. I, 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 I'm going to run for it. You should get collected, too, and then you should run for it. Okay, Molly, we'll both run for it, and maybe we'll get out of here. I hope so. Is she ever going to drop me into the, the, the like, the toy thing? Okay, we're, we're out of here, Daisy. Come on, run! Okay, I've got to find an exit. There's got to be one here around here somewhere. Wait, let's go this way, Daisy, this way! Oh, it's like an abbey. If we get out of here... Then, um, maybe we can be turned back into our normal selves. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait, did I just get put back into the claw game? No! Daisy? Uh, sorry, Molly, but it turns out that now I'm in charge of the claw. Daisy, no! How could you? You went over to the dark side! Evil! Well, Molly, I think maybe you're finding over you your possession with the claw. <laughs> think again, Daisy. Think again. You can never escape! The lore of the crane game. <laughs> Whoa, this crane game is so fun. You gotta keep playing. Gotta keep playing. Could you stop looking at videos of cute puppies on YouTube and look up who's going to be our partners in the science fail? Um, right now, I'm doing something very important. Look at these adorable little puppies. They're so cute. Molly, I'm being serious. Come on. Check your email and see who's in our group. Okay, fine. Whoa! Brookie's in our group! Hooray! Molly, that's only three of us. There's supposed to be four. Let's see who the other person is. What? Sarah's in our group? But, but... Molly, that's totally gonna ruin our sleepover. I know! We were gonna have this sleepover so we could have fun and work on our science fair project with the other group members, but now we have to invite Sarah! Well, Molly, it's the only way. I'll call Sarah, you call Brookie. I don't want Sarah to come to the sleepover. She's always kind of mean to me at school. Hey, Molly, what's up? Hey, Brookie, it's... It's not that great of a day. What? Why, Molly? What's wrong? Well, I I'm super happy that because you're in my you're in my science fair group. Wait, what? I didn't get that email yet. Yeah, you are. Well, you don't sound too happy about me being in your science fair group. Aren't we friends anymore? No, 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 no. We're best friends. That's why I was gonna have you sleep over tonight and work on the science fair project together. Daisy's in our group, too. Well, then what's the problem, Molly? Sarah's also in our group. Say what? Sarah? What are we going to do if she comes to the sleepover? I guess we'll just have to survive it. Are you coming or not? Of course, Molly. We're not going to let Sarah ruin our science fair sleepover, right? We're still going to get all of our project done for the science fair and eat popcorn and watch a movie and have fun. I hope so. 
Aww. I hope we have enough snacks for everybody. I don't want anybody to be hungry at this sleepover. Uh, Molly, the guests have started arriving. What are you wearing? Molly, when the bully from school comes to your sleepover, it's always a battle. Oh, yeah, yeah, it is. <laughs> Let's just go out and um, try to be nice. There's nobody here. Oh, I thought I heard the doorbell. That was kind of weird. Oh my gosh, don't tell me it's a ghost! Molly, don't be ridiculous. <laughs> They're real, you know. They're real! Yeah, I'm sorry I can't come to your party. I gotta do this lame, like, sleepover thing with these losers from school to, like, get our science fair project done tonight. Hey, who are you calling a loser? I made popcorn and, 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 and we have candy bars. That's not very losery. Molly, just try to get along with Sarah, okay? Just like me, I'm gonna turn my phone upside down. Hey guys, what's up? Brookie, I'm so glad to see you. Oh, Sarah's already being herself. Well, then we should definitely be ourselves. Be super friendly, offer her lots of snacks, get this science fair project done, and never hang out with her again. Good idea. So, um, Sarah, wanna get off your phone? Not really, I need to take this one. And also, I'm probably gonna get in your hot tub. Okay, guys, let's go into the kitchen because my idea is that we make a volcano. What? Make a volcano? You can't make one of those. Sure you can. You just need the right ingredients. Baking soda. Oh, you mean like a mini volcano. That would be amazing for the science fair. Do you guys have any snacks? I'm super hungry before we get started. Yeah, of course. There's treats. There's apples. There's... You know, all sorts of healthy stuff, too. Sarah, we're getting started on our project, Sarah. Yeah, um, I'm in the hot tub right now. You guys do this science fair project. Sarah, we're not just going to do all the work without you. Well, when you get to the fun part, if there is any one, one fun part about this sleepover, let me know. Ugh, she's so annoying. So, yeah, that's pretty much what Luke said. Wait, what did Luke say? Oh, nothing, Molly. You missed the whole conversation. Okay, let's get ready to work on our science fair project. Here's all the ingredients you said you needed to do this, Daisy. So, um, I put in the effort of actually getting this stuff. You have to build it. Molly, we're going to build it together. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, good idea, Molly. We can mix all the ingredients in that bucket. I know. I'm so smart. I should get an A+++++++++ plus 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 on the science fair project. Well... I'm just putting up these cones just in case things get a little hazardous in here. <laughs> Daisy, you're always thinking so smart. Uh, it's just a science fair project. It's not like it's gonna explode or something. Amali, um, that's the whole point of a volcano? To explode? Oh, wow. Guess you're right. Yes, we did it! We did it! No help from Sarah. Oh, look, the science fair project is done. Well, I guess you can go home now. Don't worry, we'll give you credit for it. Just don't stay for the sleepover. Actually, I have to because ugh, my parents said they don't want me driving after dark. So, yeah, I'm staying. Ugh, fine. All right, everybody, let's go eat popcorn and watch a movie. Molly, pass the popcorn. I'm trying to, but it's so good. I just keep eating it all. Uh, yeah, I'm in slim sleepover right now, and... Hey, no talking during the movie on your cell phone! Haven't you ever seen that when you're at the movie theater? Turn your phone off! I'm not at the movie theater. I'm at your lame house, and... Seriously, Sarah, shh! We're watching the movie! Yeah, Sarah, what do you want to do since you don't want to watch the movie, obviously? Well, I don't care about the movie. I just want to eat the popcorn, really. <laughs> what I want to do is play hide and seek at 3 a.m. What? Why? Because terrible and scary things happen when you play hide and seek at 3 a.m. Oh, that's nothing but a myth. <laughs> I bet you guys are too chicken to do it. Um, no, we're not. I'll watch this movie and hang out with you losers if you will do the 3 a.m. challenge. Challenge accepted. Now sit down and be quiet. I want to hear this movie. All right, fine. <laughs> Wake up, losers. It's 3 a.m. Time to play hide and seek, if you dare. 
Huh, what? What? I thought you were just joking around about this. Ah, she's pouring water on my head! Me too! That's so rude, Sam! How can you be doing that? Well, you have to get up so we can play hide and seek. Why do you want to do this so badly? Are you wanting to know what happens? Of course I do, duh. And I won't be too sad if, you know, the ghost takes one of you away. What? Seriously? Oh, I'm going back to sleep. No, I'm going to spray you with water unless you get up and play this game. Besides, you promised and I watched that lame movie. All right, fine. <sighs> All right, I'll go downstairs and uh, hide, I guess. Wait, who's it? I'll be it. You guys go hide. Fine. Ah, oh, man, it is way too early for this. Maybe I should turn off the lights, though, so she can't see where I am. All right, I don't know if that was the right light, because it's not turning off. Daisy, this light won't turn off. Thank you, Daisy. Welcome, Molly. Now, shh, we have to hide. Okay, fine. Ah! Oh, 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 what was that? Oh, my gosh. I'm probably just seeing things, because because I'm half asleep. Molly, are you okay? You look like you've just seen a ghost. Hi, I, 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 I. Okay, I, I didn't see a ghost. I, I just thought I did. Yeah, this whole 3 a.m. thing is, like, not even real. Guys, we have to find a place to hide. Ah! What was that? Ah! I did see a ghost! Holy guacamole! Okay, now we need to hide from not Sarah, but the ghost! Oh my gosh, this is terrifying. Where can I hide that you won't find me? I know, I'll get in the hot tub. Yeah, ghosts don't like getting in the hot tub, do they? I don't know, Molly, but I don't like this. Not even one bit. Never play hide and seek at 3 a.m. Brookie, is that you behind me? Yeah, it's me, but guys, do you guys see that ghost over there? Ah! Oh my gosh! This is gonna give me a heart attack. It's so scary. Well, she doesn't seem to like water, so we should all hide in here. Come on, Brookie, before she gets you. Ha 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 ha! What are you fools doing in the hot tub in your pajamas? What are you talking about? You had us play hide and seek at 3 a.m. and it, and it, it spawned this evil ghost! Good thing she doesn't like water because we were all figured that out and then just got in the hot tub. Oh, Molly, she's still here. What are you losers talking about? There's not a ghost here. You couldn't see her because she was behind you. Look around, Sarah. You're going to see her. What? I don't, I don't see a ghost. This is ridiculous. I'm going back to bed. I'm going to pretend this night never happened. Um, evil ghost? I, I don't want to play hide and seek at 3 a.m. anymore, um, so you can just go away now. Oh, that was scary. Wait, where's my sleeping bag? I need my sleeping bag again. I need to respawn it. Okay, um, right there. Perfect. All right, everybody just get back into bed, and let's just pretend this didn't happen. What? I don't think so. I found all you losers, so now I get to hide while you count. We don't want to play this anymore, Sarah. There's definitely an evil force in this house. You don't play hide and seek at 3 a.m. Well, now it's 4 a.m. Count! Oh, man, she's bossy. Okay, one, two, three, four. Daisy, come over here and count. And where's Brookie? I think she might have gone home. She was kind of afraid. Five, six, wait, did I already say five and six? I don't know. 100, ready or not, here we come. I really hope I don't see that ghost again. She was so creepy. Me too, Molly, me too. Okay, who put the, all right, who put the sleeping bag over the, oh my gosh, ah! Okay, that didn't work out as planned. A sleeping bag went into the, <laughs> into the um uh, elevator, and then I got in it, and then I fell out of the elevator. Oh, boy, Molly. You a hot mess. All right, Sarah, we're coming. Where are you? Sarah, where are you? Boo! Ah! It's another ghost! Ha! Ah, run! Ha, 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 ha. I scared them so good. Ha, 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 ha. This ghost costume is awesome. Ha, 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 ha. What was that? Ha! Ah, there is a ghost! Well, I guess Sarah finally saw the ghost. Molly, let's make a pact to never play hide and seek at 3 a.m. again. Yeah, good point. Creepy. Now let's go up into our... Ah! Oh my God, Brooke, you scared me. Sorry, I'm scared too. I'm trying to hide from that evil ghost. Well, make room for me because um, I think we're all going to sleep in the same bed. 
Since we're all afraid. Sounds like a good idea to me, Molly. Does anybody see the ghost? Nope. But, uh, I think we should sleep with one eye open. <laughs> So Molly, which uh, movie do you think we should see? I don't know, something like super funny, just like relaxing, you know, I had like a long day. No, 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 I think we should see something scary. No, no scary! Yes, yeah, scary! Whoa, The Babysitter, I remember that movie. So creepy! Um, The Golden Arm, seriously? I don't know about that one, I heard it got bad reviews. How about The Passenger? Um, that one looks really creepy. I don't know. It says so creepy. Talk about chills. No way. Totally creeped me out. That sounds perfect. Two for the passenger, please. Are you sure? That's a really scary movie. Uh, you're being really scary right now. Holy moly. Yeah, she does, um, have kind of a scary voice, doesn't she? Uh, yeah. Oh, saying I already purchased it. That's because I purchased it for you, Molly. Okay, here we go. Oh, I'm kind of afraid. Welcome. Okay, why does everybody around here have a creepy voice? Just stop right now. You're already creeping me out. I want to run home. Molly, come on. Okay, I'm coming. Well, um, this looks like the Stranger Things entrance right here. I don't know. I can't do the music. I tried to do the music, I can't do it. <laughs> if you've seen Stranger Things, you already know the music. So creepy, talk about chills. Okay, we're on an escalator right now. Okay, here we go. Maggie was so excited about going to her senior dance at the high school, she could hardly contain herself. I'd be super excited about that too. Uh-huh, sure, okay. This escalator moves really slow. As soon as she was ready, she grabbed her sweater and ran out front. The girls would be here to pick her up soon. Go back now. Go back now. Molly, you're giving away the story. Okay, so the fact that there was a big, bold, like, sign that said so creepy didn't give it away? Of course there was. Before she knew it, the girls were there. She jumped into the car, and off they went. It looks like they're going to have so much fun at the school dance, right, Daisy? Absolutely, Molly. I think they're going to have a great time. Yeah, and still something really creepy happens. Everyone was so excited, they rushed into the school and went straight to the gymnasium to see the decorations. Whoa, he looks cool for the school dance. She's got a good date. <laughs> Everyone's got a date, except for that carload of girls. They don't have dates. Oh, I think he's on the football team and she's a cheerleader. Looks that way, Molly. They're wearing football jerseys. Yeah. Okay, let's go to the next. Let's go to the next scene. Whoa, I want to go to this dance. Boom, chicka, boom, chicka, boom, boom, boom. Me too, Molly. This looks fun. The band is awesome. Hey now, hey now. My name is Daisy, hey now. Daisy, that's not a real song. Okay, well, I couldn't think of anything else. The decorations were wonderful, and everyone was having a great time. Until dun dun dun, certain death. Molly, nothing like that's gonna happen. Aw, oh, it said so, so creepy. Remember? But after a while, Maggie found herself alone. No one asked her to the dance or paid any attention to her. She was sad. Oh! And she's wearing her best outfit, too. What's she carrying? A tissue, Molly! Oh, I thought it was a teddy bear. I was like, if you take your teddy bear to the school dance, no one or no one's going to talk to you. That's just weird. It's a tissue, Molly! Okay, yeah, it's a tissue. Ooh, fruit punch. I love that. I want some. Molly! Sorry. Okay, geez. I guess I don't have to have any fruit punch. I'm at the movies there. Shouldn't I have some sort of snacks? Maggie decided to leave the dance and walk home alone. And this is when she dies because that's the dumbest move to do ever. Molly, you're ruining it. You don't even know it's going to happen yet. Maggie, don't do this. Turn around. Go back to the dance. It's better to be sad than dead. Okay, never mind. I can't convince her. Ugh. 
I'm getting nervous right now, can you tell? Why are you nervous? It's only a movie. Daisy, where are you? I'm just in the next scene. Jeez. Maggie never felt so alone. The, long walk, the walk was long and scary. I could have told you that. You're in a horror movie. If you walk in the forest alone, it's going to be long and scary. It's just the way that this works. As Maggie began to cross the town bridge, a car came racing past, almost hitting her. Wow, rude. Molly, things are about to get crazy. I just know it. Yeah, a monster's going to be in that car. I bet you a monster. I'm going to say an alien. No, it's definitely a monster. By the time Maggie crossed the bridge, she was feeling very sick. She sat down on a log for a rest. Oh, man, this girl's having a horrible dance night. First, no one asked her to the dance. Then she just stands at the dance alone. Then someone almost runs her over. Then she gets a stomach ache. Wow, sounds terrible. Must have been the cookies, Molly. They probably were rotten. Yeah, or the fruit punch or something. After a few minutes, another car pulled up and stopped. The man got out and walked over to Maggie to check on her. Do, do, do! And by the way, there's someone in this game called the Hidden Ninja. So he could be anywhere, guys. I'm not sure right, right where he is. But he is a hidden ninja. Okay, where'd the text go? Okay, the text, like, disappeared. Wait, I think it's up there. Okay, wait a minute. Okay, so he's gonna give her a ride home. Bad idea. Do not get in the car with strangers, people. This is bad. Wait, I just saw the hidden ninja! What? That's cool. Bye. Oh, there he goes. He's hidden again. She told him about the dance and what had happened. He tried to cheer up as best he could. It was nice. Still, never get in a car with people. That is a bad idea. Never do it. Soon Maggie was home and the man wished her well and told her to feel better. Maggie thanked him and he drove off. Okay, I'm running to the next one. I can't even wait to see what happens. After the man got home, he realized that Maggie had left her sweater in the car. Oh, that was a sweater, not a tissue. That kind of looks like a ghost. Come on, Daisy, you're getting behind. Sorry, I just thought it was a tissue too. He thought he would drop it off in the morning on his way to work, since it was too late at night now. Oh no, something really crazy is going to happen. The next morning, the man went to Maggie's house to drop off the sweater. An old woman answered the door. Who's the old woman? I don't know. Maybe it's her grandma. He told her he'd given Maggie a ride home the night before and she had left her sweater in the car. She looked very sad and stared at the sweater. This is Maggie's sweater, all right. She took it to the, to the high school dance with her. Oh my gosh, I think I might know what's going to happen. Really? What? Well, whoever you drove home last night wasn't Maggie. Maggie died when she was hit by a speeding car on the town bridge. But that was over 50 years ago. Ah! She's a ghost! This is creepy! I knew it was going to be creepy. I thought so. Something's going to happen on the next screen. I'm not going. I'm not going. Ah! Okay, you're just another player. Oh, I thought you were Maggie and you were a creepy ghost and you were following me. Um, no. Okay, you're dressed, you're dressed like a giraffe, though. That's kind of cool. Okay, what's happening? What's happening? Ah! That guy's standing there. He's creeped out. I'm going to scream. Something's going to jump on my screen. I just know it. Okay, deep breath, because it's coming. It's coming! Oh, no! I know it's going to come! Ah! Ah! I knew it was there! Oh, my gosh. She's creepy. Maggie, Whoa, well, my gosh. Maggie! What happened to you? Oh, Maggie, you're creepy. Your eyes are creepy. Oh, get me out of here. I don't even want any popcorn. Oh, 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 I survived it. Oh. oh, let's go into that one. I see you. He said I dropped my phone. So, so scary. Um, no. I'm done. I'm out of here. I'm going home. Was it as fun as you thought? <laughs> okay, you're creepy too. You're fired. Maddie, you're not the boss here. I don't care. You're fired. You're all fired. You're all creepy. I don't like it. And, and everybody that's watching this, you're not creepy. You should subscribe to our channel. But everybody else, you're creepy and I don't like it.
Oh, brother, next time I'm taking a friend to this, you just can't handle these stories. Ugh. 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 Guys, let me know in the comment section below if you've seen this story before and it did it scare you. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll see you tomorrow for another amazing video. Hopefully it's not terrifying. Bye! on some fractions. I know you guys are a little bit scared. Whoa, I can't write today. <laughs> I spelled it wrong. I know you guys are a little afraid of fractions. They seem really hard, but don't worry. I'm going to help you through it. And everyone will know how to do fractions by the end of the school year, okay? Jiminy Cricket, what was that? Was that thunder? It's probably some freak storm and, you know, we are going to all be doomed. Wow, Molly, could you be any more dramatic? Well, no, not really. But anyway, I'm just kidding because I saw the weather and it's supposed to be like blue skies and sunny today. Well, maybe the weather people were wrong. They seem to never know what the weather is going to be. Well, that's true. I don't know where that is lately. Are they letting every meteorologist pass college or something? Must be. But maybe it's just hard to guess. I don't know. But they have equipment to help them. I'm going to look outside and see if there's any storms going on. It looks like there's some dark clouds coming from over there, teacher. Maybe we should all have early dismissal. Nice try, Molly. But there's no early dismissal today. We're going to be learning about fractions. Now, the first thing you need to know... Um, I have a question. Um, it's starting to look really dark outside. I think we're going to get a storm. Uh, and it looks like an angry one. What? Oh, I I didn't think we were supposed to get the storm that's, that's hitting Blocksburg. They're getting a terrible, terrible hurricane. Oh my, this does look like the hurricane's actually going to hit us. Oh boy, I better get inside and check out the weather station and see what it says. Um, teacher, I, I really don't think it's a good idea we stay here. Well, if the hurricane's hitting, we can't leave either. It can be dangerous. The roads will be flooded for sure. Let me just tune into the weather station on my iPad. Breaking news, breaking news. The hurricane that hit Blocksburg is now hitting Brookhaven too. Stay put. I repeat, do not drive. Do not go outside your house. This hurricane is extremely dangerous. You should lock down exactly where you are. Oh my, this isn't good. Stuck in the school? Oh, we don't even have sleeping bags or pajamas or anything. Oh! Uh, anybody else notice our teacher is totally freaking out right now? Well, Molly, in her defense, hurricanes can be incredibly dangerous. Well, I guess we're not learning about fractions today. We're learning a lot about hurricanes, though. Um, uh, Molly, I'm kind of nervous. I don't like big storms. Well, then why are you smiling? Um, because I smile a lot when I'm nervous. It's sort of this thing I have where I just, I, 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 I also giggle a lot when I'm nervous. <laughs> Oh, I never knew about this about you, Brookie. But that's because you've never seen her this nervous. <laughs> We're all going to die in a hurricane. <laughs> oh, this is so lame. Brookie, are you okay? You have no face right now. <laughs> I can't stop laughing. That's why. O-M-G. Okay, Brookie's gone insane. Molly, maybe we should go outside and, you know, check and see if the weather's really bad. Okay, I'll be the one to do it because I'm the most brave. Here we go. Oh, the sky is red. Uh, I've never seen it do that before. Oh my God, this is creepy. Oh yeah, the rain is coming and the, and the wind. What? Did I just see lightning? Oh my gosh, I did just see lightning and now the sky is purple. I better get back inside. Daisy, what are you doing? I'm taking measurements. I've never seen a storm like this in my life. Like guacamole, Daisy. We better get inside. This is dangerous out here. Yeah, yeah. Wait a minute. Why are you so tall all of a sudden? I had a growth spurt. <laughs> Why are you going to catch up? You seem so short lately. Holy moly. Um, teacher, teacher. There's a lot of lightning, a lot of rain, a lot of wind, and the sky is purple and red. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we really are going to die. Nobody panic. Nobody panic. I don't think it's safe for us to be near these windows, though. 
We're all going to move into the gym since it's more centrally located inside the school and we'll start setting up to spend the night there. Um, is there anything to eat because I'm starting to get hungry? Yes, I'll go to the cafeteria and pick up some supplies. You guys head to the gym and I'll meet you there. On second thought, look at all these windows to the outside. This is probably more dangerous than I thought. Are you like trained at all for disasters? O-M-G. Yes, I'm just a little bit nervous, okay? This is my first year as a teacher and I didn't expect to be stuck in a hurricane. It's okay. Um, just, just, um, basically take us to the auditorium and everything will be okay because there's no windows in there. Oh, Daisy, what would I do without you? You're the best student ever. Come on, everyone, to the auditorium. Okay, everyone file in, please. Single file, no pushing. I'm just going to pull up the weather channel again and see if there's any updates. Breaking news, breaking news. Everyone, panic! This is the worst hurricane Brookhaven has ever seen! Everything's flooded. Oh, make sure you get to high ground, but stay inside. Make sure you have enough food, but don't go to the grocery store. Make sure you get enough sleep and take care of yourself, but don't close your eyes. You never know what's going to happen next. Okay, we're turning off the iPad. That's just freaking me out. All right, everyone. I did find some uh, sleeping bags in the supply room. Must be they were there for emergencies. So I'm going to spread everyone's sleeping bag out up here on the stage. And this will be where we sleep tonight. And I also brought some snacks. Brookie, are you still freaking out? I'm, I'm sort of hyperventilating. Brookie, it's going to be okay. Everyone's safe. Just think of this as a really interesting sleepover. I mean, we had to invite, invite Sarah, but you know. Whatever. Like, I'd ever come to a loser sleepover anyway. Well, Sarah, we'd probably invite you, even if you didn't want to come, just because we're nice like that. Well, I'm not nice like that, and I probably wouldn't come. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it! We're in a hurricane! Yeah, but we're also having an amazing sleepover. According to this little instrument that I found in the science room that's supposed to measure the weather, but I'm not a meteorologist, so I don't know what it's called. What? You don't know what it's called? Daisy, I can't even believe this right now. Ah, uh, yeah, I feel a little, um, sad in myself that I don't know what this meteorologist equipment is. I'll, I'll make notes and have to look this up when I get home. But anyway, according to that, the worst of the storm is happening right now. Ah, uh, you could say that. There are actually some windows backstage, and I did see some lightning. What? The teacher told us that, 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 that there was no windows in here. Well, it's the spot that's the least windows, Bookie, and the most protected. Don't worry. Everything's going to be okay. I don't believe you. I'm starting to freak out, and now I really just want to cry. Bookie, I promise everything's going to be okay. Your best friend is right here. Okay, everybody, I brought some food. Bean burritos, tacos. Do you guys like Mexican food? Oh, my gosh. I love Mexican food. Oh, no. It's going to be terrible. What, the storm? No, you, after you eat that bean burrito. Oh, yeah. We don't want to feed Molly a bean burrito. Too late. Mm, this is actually quite delicious. Mm, this is so good. <coughs> oh, my God. Molly's farting already. She just took the first bite of a bean burrito. <coughs> Uh, I think I'd rather be out in the hurricane. What? It's not that bad. <coughs> Molly, you fought it ten times in the last five seconds. <coughs> Ew, Molly! That stinks so bad. Where's my gas mask? <laughs> I think there's an emergency in the gym. I mean, in the auditorium. Wait, where are we again? Brookie, you're still freaking out right now. It's gonna be okay, Brookie. I promise. And I have an extra bean burrito that I'm gonna eat. <coughs> Molly, please don't. <coughs> Molly! No more bean burritos for Molly. She's sworn to not eat anymore. Okay, class. I want everyone to get into their sleeping bags. Molly, no more bean burritos. Seriously. We all have to actually sleep in here. <laughs> I can't believe we're sleeping in the auditorium at school. This is so weird. Yeah, but I think the storm is starting to pass now. I think you're right, class, but I think you should stay here for the night just to be safe. <sighs> I'm getting tired anyway. This was kind of stressful. I know what you mean. <laughs> this dress makes me laugh. Did I tell you that yet? Yes, like so many times. You're so annoying. I know. I'm sorry. I just can't help it. Sarah, she's not annoying. She's my best friend and she can't help it. She's just scared. Yeah, I think we all will. 
But in the morning, we'll go home and hopefully everything will be fine. Yeah, hopefully.